my mama. Girl, it's not appropriate. It's not appropriate. It's just not appropriate. None of this is appropriate. Like, honestly. Oh. Okay, my hey everybody, what's going on? My are reduced for two weeks and <laughs> now I'm having an existential crisis. My work hours are reduced for two company, weeks. I'm gonna face. stream more. I'm just like, oh my god. Like, I hate it. I don't love it. Damn, nobody want you for real my YouTube channel be like. <laughs> hey, thank you so much, Trolley and Caviam and Mutant. Right Hi, everyone. Oh How's God, everyone doing? Thank you so much, Sucker Punchin' and Mutant. Thank you so much. 24-hour stream. Oh, not today, babes. Not today. I'm live. Okay. I want to be live about four hours earlier than this. I want to be live. You got hired at Goodwill? Oh my god! Hi, That's super flame. fun. You probably make good I've money there, right? And you can steal really easily. And you need to be with Thank me you now. so much. Impregnation is mandatory to feed our flame Thank and you. serenity. Oh my god. Can no, I want to be like four hours earlier than this. <laughs> but you guys, it's just been a... Okay, let me talk. Let me talk because <sighs> the schizophrenia is here. <laughs> <laughs> EA? Games? Okay, where am I? Like, I'm still not, like, how do I get my camera out? Wait 50 months, sim officially the <laughs> well, I just had a brain fart. Oh, there. My flowers. <laughs> All you do is talk? Okay, don't be nasty. Don't be fucking nasty, you little motherfucking bitch. Okay. 50 months. Oh my god, thank you so much, Live Brains, for the 50 months. I really appreciate that. Your cam looks 4K. Does it look good today? Did you move? Are you streaming from an asylum? Why is it so echoey? Well, I'm in prison. I'm in prison today. Why is my camp so good? I don't know. You know what? I resetted my computer. <laughs> <gasps> oh, that gave me a migraine. Thank you so Troll much for the five gifted. gifted. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much for the five gifted. Everyone say thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Oh my god, my balls have been itching for like five days. Never mind, that was so scary. Nick old, Nick flop, Nick stash. Okay, listen. I have to get this off my chest. <laughs> Trollimaldi's gifted a tier one okay. sub to Jasmine Rios. Yes, I'm still fundraising for my pug, you guys. Even though it says ended 21 hours ago, it hasn't. But honestly, I feel like I don't love dogs. But I need Trollimaldi's to get one. Trollimaldi's <laughs> gifted a tier one sub to Everybody here has a dog. Okay, can I vent? <laughs> no, fuck. Okay, here's... Okay, let let me vent, okay? Trollimaldi's so gifted a tier one yeah, sub we are. to Alana Banana 12. <laughs> I haven't gone to this. I haven't gone to the store. The only store I've gone to is the grocery store. I don't like leaving my house living here. I don't. I hate everybody that lives in Tennessee. Hi, Mama. Like I hate everybody that lives here. I haven't met anybody that I like. Not one person. Everybody is like just horrible here. Also, also. Hello, love. How are you? Oh, Taylor. No, I love Taylor. I'm a Swifty. Um. Okay, listen. Was anybody else? Okay, I was on TikTok and the weather app, and apparently, like, where I am was... They closed the schools here. Businesses closed. We were on Tornado Watch. There was supposed to be a huge storm. Babe, it barely rained. I mean, is it... For anyone who's in my area, like, Tennessee, Ohio, Virginia, like... Is anybody else not getting any weather? Like... <laughs> It barely rained. Like, it rained more when I first moved here. Like, it's snowing here. I wish it was snowing here. Where are you? Are you in Ohio? Apparently, it's really bad in Ohio. No, you're in Ohio and it's not bad. They said that it was going to be, like, tornadoes. They literally closed the schools here and they're closing businesses because of a severe weather warning. My landlord even sent out a message, bring all your furniture inside, which I don't have furniture, but bring all your furniture inside. Like, don't go outside. You're going to die. Girl, it didn't, it, it barely fucking rained. Like, I still went to Circle K and got me a little soda pop in the middle of the tornado watch. I don't give a fuck. Because at the end of the day, first of all, I'm too big and greedy for a tornado to even pick me up, I feel. Like, oh my god, I, I had a Twix bar today. Furniture shopping stream when? I don't know where to go. <laughs> like, I don't know where to go to get furniture. So I'm just not getting furniture. Like, I, I, I don't even know where to go to get furniture. There's no Ikea. Like, where do you want me to go? There's a big lot. I'm not shopping at big lots. I feel like they have a sex ring or something. I'll allow yapping if you give me your honest opinion on Cowboy Carter. 
Only say good things or you have seven days. I Okay, I did end my stream <laughs> earlier last time because I was having a Cowboy Carter party. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. It wasn't what I was expecting, but I enjoyed it. I, I had to restart. Oh my God. I could tell you my, my favorite songs because I favorite them on Spotify. But the worst thing happened to me. Okay, I was going to be live like literally an hour ago. I was going to be. Did you guys not like Cowboy Carter? It was kind of sickening though. Scarter Boo, Bodyguard is so good, Lies. I, okay, my biggest complaint was it was too many songs. Like, it was just too many songs. Like, after listening to it for like an hour, I was like, oh my god, this needs to end. But then a lot of the good songs were at the end. Hi, but, Mama, I just got out of the psych ward. How are you? Did you make it to Tennessee? <laughs> Girl. What's crazy is you guys are literally psychotic. Like, I don't, is this a slur? Nymphoid? <laughs> I don't know if that's a slur or not, but I keep hearing that word and I really like it. It's like so cute. Oh my god, Nora, I had Hi, your Nikki Steam Poo. thing open, How but I had to reset my sound? computer. I've been oh, trying to send you the friend request on Steam for like the past three days. I keep, it's still the same era, but I think I found a solution. If you go to your friends thing, there's a Mama, link you can send. You, can you send me that link shit, like on my Twitter or Discord or something? We do not like her for ARE. We can be like this shit anymore. Streams listen to this, so we do not like her anymore. Honestly, you guys, I know I was ranting and raving about that Camila Cabello song, but I don't listen to it. <laughs> listen to it. I don't. I haven't. I, 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 I put it on when I start my stream because I know it will annoy you guys. I did like it. I did like it. I wasn't lying. Like, I did like it. But I don't listen to it. <laughs> I don't put it on. I listened to it like the day it came out like 10 times. And then since then, I don't listen to it at all. Nick, my little pookie. <laughs> I've been playing Life is Strange for the first time this week and you let Kate Marsh die. <laughs> You're sick in the head. She does. Okay. This is the song I'm obsessed with right now. Um, what is it called? Oh, what's that Paramore song? I'm really obsessed with the Paramore song that Quinn showed me that I really love. Okay. This is how it goes. Uh, you close your eyes and they get dark and it makes me sad. It may. How does it go? What is that? We're the Paramore fans. No, not into you. What the fuck is this? You see how they advertise fucking AI on everything now? Oh, it just disappeared. Never mind. What is that? What, what is it? No, I hate Paramore, but I love them now because my babe loves Paramore. What is it? What? Oh. Hold on. I, I, I'm going to ask Quinn. I'm going to ask Quinn. What was that? Babe? What's that Paramore song that I really love? Okay, thank you. Okay, yeah, he told me. I, I do love it. I wouldn't know the name if I could have my... <laughs> this song I love. This song is really cute, you guys. Quinn showed me this one. This song is really cute, you guys. Wow, big surprise. You didn't like Beyonce's album. I also, did! you still have that wooden <laughs> pissed soap chair. Yeah, no. on that mallet. Okay, this is my current chair. You can't really see it. It's a bar stool. It's like a leather bar stool. It's, it's, it's definitely an upgrade. It's definitely an upgrade. I love this song. This song is really cute. But anyway, what was I saying? Oh, okay, yeah, I know I said I was, I was gonna get on schedule. It's not time for me to get on schedule. Like, it's gonna be here and there. I'm still like, okay. Let me vent about living here in Tennessee so far. So I've lived in Florida, which I feel like is not considered the South, even though it's the most Southern state in America. But okay, I lived in Florida for seven years. It's so much better than living in Tennessee. Okay, living in Tennessee so far, first of all, first of all, we were going out yesterday and somebody's dog peed in that. The only way to get up and down in this building is through an elevator. There's no stairs, which I feel like is a fire hazard and illegal, but there's no stairs. Like, there's no fire exit. I guess you could jump off the balcony, but you'd probably I die. Like, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. So there's only, there's only the elevator. And I'm scared of elevators. I don't Nick, even like elevators. Nick, you react to me crushing a poop in my ass for a hundred <laughs> years and it turns to a beautiful pearl? <laughs> oh my god, no. I, I really want to like extract one of my own testicles and then like, not cremate it, but like, you know, so you know how they surround it in glass and like in amber and it could be preserved for like many years? I want that. And then I'll just keep it like right on my like end table when I get one because I don't have one. It's like, oh yeah, that's, that's like my little beautiful testicle. You know? Because gay, when you're gay, you don't need testicles because you can't reproduce. Which I've seen a lot of stuff about that online. It's like, oh, the birth rate's going in the shitter. Yeah, because we all hate fucking kids. Like, I'm sorry. Young people like me, I'm young still. 
we don't like children. Like, why would we want to have them? Also, we can't afford them. Like, if I had a child, I'd have a donation goal up here. Every single stream would be like, little Jimmy's lunch, $20. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, little Jimmy needs a new backpack, $15. <laughs> <laughs> like, girls. Like, I, I could not imagine. You know, when my mom was my age, I'm 25. My mom must have had, she had four kids. How the fuck did she afford that? Like, how You're did my, my mother afford content that? Creator. To you have... helped me get through so many hard days. I hope you are settling into your new home. That means a free. lot to me. I've been feeling oh, okay. really bad about my streaming because I feel like I've been being so boring, so inconsistent, which is normal for me. But, oh, you guys, let me just tell you. Did you say jump off the balcony? <laughs> Fine. <laughs> okay. I have lived here for like a week and I've barely streamed, okay? And you know what my landlord texts me? I got a noise complaint. I already got a noise complaint living here. A noise complaint. They said one of the neighbors is saying that I'm blasting music late at night. That I'm blasting music late at night. And that that's unnecessary sound. <laughs> Babe, I haven't played any music. I literally haven't played music one time, unless it was through my headphones. I have n I don't have- what am I blessed- hello? Hello? With what? With what? What am I blasting music with, girl? I'm not lying. I'm literally not lying. Like, I- I ha- I literally haven't played music not even one time. So we told him, we said, we haven't even played music one time. So it must have been from somebody else's apartment because he said if it's coming from somebody else's apartment, let us know. I said, okay, it must be because I haven't played music at all. Like, not so even one time. So is your streaming era over? How many hours did you have last month? <sighs> Honestly, I'm gonna be leaving my stream on overnight and just playing cat rerun episodes of Catfish tonight because I need to get my ad revenue up. Are you guys okay with that? Like, if I just leave my stream on for a couple hours, like ten. <laughs> okay, and this is not not you blasting. No, I don't yes, know. Yes, everyone. They must it's have heard me, it from somebody else. The guy else, in Discord so who was playing quiet. Cookie Run Kingdom at the Gag City tour. <laughs> yes. I want to see that picture. Okay, so that happened, and that put me in such a bad mood because I don't know if the walls are thin here because I haven't heard anybody else one time. I haven't heard anybody take a shower. They tell us don't run your dryer after nine o'clock, don't vacuum, like, you know, they say there's quiet time. I've never heard anybody take a shower, anybody flush their toilet, I've never heard anybody's dryer. I've never heard anybody else living at all. I've never heard anybody walk. I've never, I've never heard it. So I'm like, did you see Gaga Joker me? movie poster? She looks so rough. I haven't seen Margot it yet. Margot Robbie, you were so much younger and beloved then it that washed be that up. Echo. Used Maybe to be cool dad. hag. My new neighbors are so Go to loud. hell, Gaga. I'm just saying, like, I don't know how other people could hear me when I don't hear anybody else at all. Like. So I don't know. <laughs> anyway, so I got that complaint and it really irritated me. I'll tell you why it irritated, irritated me. Thank you so much, it's Edward. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. And E-Boy and Reba, I really appreciate it. About, it wasn't the, so I streamed three days ago. Not that night that I got a stream, but the next night. This is what irritated me about getting a noise complaint. It was probably 4 a.m. And I was just playing Stardew on my computer. So it was Quinn, we were just playing Stardew. And we heard, I don't know where it was, we were gonna call the cops. Yeah, that's my dryer that's on right now, that I'm not allowed to run past nine o'clock at night. Jenny P gifted a tier Thank one so sub to Jenny Lunix P. and Dominates. We were gonna they call They have the given cops nine gift subs in the channel. Because we heard, it, I, 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 did, I would have called the cops, but I didn't know which apartment it was coming from. Like, I couldn't tell. It was like a dog barking crazy, slamming. It was a guy screaming at the top of his lungs and a woman crying and bawling. 
I don't know. It sounded like somebody was getting beat up, girl. It sounded like somebody was getting beat up. For real. Like, it was really bad. And it was at, like, four in the morning. It was, like... I was... We were really scared. We were like, it's four in the morning. Like, this girl can't get away. But I don't know what was... I haven't... I don't know what was happening. It was somewhere... It was like coming. It was Nick definitely Dom, beneath U us. Nick Dom, U W U, Nick Dom, U W U, Nick Dom, U W U, Nick Dom, U W U. It was definitely beneath us. Nick Dom, U W U. Why didn't you call the cops? I don't know what apartment it, it it was in. I don't know what apartment. And I was like, okay, well, should we call the cops? Like, what should we do? Should we tell the building manager? Like, I don't know. And I was like, well, if it's down there, surely one of the next door neighbors that knows which apartment it is is gonna say something, right? That was my thought process. Like, I don't, I don't know what apartment it is, so I don't know what to do. But I was like, okay, surely somebody who's right next door is like gonna say something about it. But it was really scary. It was like really scary. Eventually they just stopped, but their dog was barking all night. It was like banging. It was really loud. So I was like, is somebody going to do something about this? And it was going on all night. But then nothing was said about it. And I didn't see cops here or anything. Like, I have... N I was like... What? But they haven't said anything about it. And then... So that was one big thing. That was at like 4 o'clock in the morning. And I was like, what if it's... No but how is that normal to other people? Like, even if it was my next door neighbor and I knew... If that was happening right next door to me, I was like, okay, that's apartment, that number. Bitch, I would have called the cops. Like, I would have called the cops and been like, hey, yeah, somebody's fighting really bad next door, and it's this apartment number, and you need to come over here right now. Like, I assumed somebody who was beneath me would call the police, because if it's your next door neighbor, you know what apartment it is, right? But it was really bad. Like, I was trying to put my, like, ear to the wall and, like, my ear to the floor, and I just heard them fighting, and they were saying things I'm not even going to repeat on this stream. Like, I wanted to figure out what was going on down there. And I, they were saying things that I would never repeat on this stream, but I don't know if anybody called the cops. I don't know what happened. So I don't know if they're getting kicked out. Like, I have no fucking idea. I have no fucking idea. So that was one thing. Then I got a noise complaint for blasting music when I don't even play music. And then yesterday, we're going down in the elevator, somebody's fucking dog pissed all in the elevator and just left it there. Like, literally just a huge puddle of piss in the elevator. And they just left it there. So me and Quinn get into the, the um, elevator and just a big pile of piss in there. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, I mean, at least the rent is cheaper, but it's not that cheap, babe. This isn't no, like, $800, $500, like, this is more than $1,000 in rent. Way more. So, like, ugh. it was not me who peed on the floor, okay? I'm just saying, like, that was really disgusting. That was just really disgusting. Yeah, this isn't, I live in Tennessee, just don't be so negative. So those were like three things that happened. I'm just like, oh my God, ew. Like so far, I hate living here. Like I literally just hate living here. I hate people who are from Tennessee. They're all so nasty. Like, oh my God, why would you move to Tennessee? I don't know, honestly. So now I've just been depressed. Why would you move to Tennessee? <laughs> I moved here to be closer to my mother, but she moved away. No, I should have come to Florida. I should have. together. Welcome to Tennessee. Like, I love Florida. Take me back to fucking Florida. Tennessee eats. What is good about it, babe? Like, what is good about Tennessee? <laughs> I need to buy a house. Honestly, I do. So I guess I'm just going to suffer here because my rent is cheap. But I don't know. Like, now I'm scared of being loud because I don't want to annoy people. But, like, also... I don't give a fuck if you can hear me. Like, I live here. I'm allowed to talk in my own apartment. I'm allowed to take a shower and run my fucking dryer. Like, huh? Like, that's the kind of shit that I don't understand is like, what, I can't run my dryer or I'm gonna get in trouble? I'm not a little five-year-old. You can't yell at me for running my dryer. 
Like, mind you, somebody downstairs is, like, getting literally beat up and you guys are not doing shit about it. Like, hello? Like, I don't know, this place is just giving me nasty vibes. Like, this place is just giving me nasty vibes right off the jump. Right off the fucking jump. And I was so excited to get a storm today. It would be, like, so rainy and moody, which is what I need right now. I need it to be rainy and moody to match my mood. And then there was no... It rained for, like, literally 20 minutes, and that was it. And we were supposed to get tornadoes, hail, windstorm. None of that even happened. They lied. Like, they literally lied. So what the fuck is that? I do want a tornado. Is that crazy? I want a tornado. I do. I want a tornado. I want giant hail. I want huge hail, uh, rainstorms and wind. That's what I want. Because I like the bad weather. I like the bad weather. Like, I miss, I, I miss whenever I, I lived in Florida and there was hurricanes every year. I love that. I did. I loved when there was a hurricane. Like, it was everything. It was like, okay, everything's just going to shut down. You know, we get to just, like, you know, stay inside. Yeah, a tree fell on my house and broke through my ceiling. But, you know, we got it patched up. <laughs> like, <laughs> I hope you scraped your knee. Is anyone getting... The bad storms in this area, though, because I even texted my mom, and she's in Virginia, and she said it barely even rained there. But she was supposed to get tornadoes. You got it, Frankie? Was it, like, Jenny so bad, or did it pass over? I'm getting a storm to tonight, Velvet. I think. Well, tell me if you they actually do. They have given do. 10 gift subs in the channel. Because, honestly, okay, this is my... This is my um, conspiracy theory, okay? Let me tell you guys. This is my, like, ultimate conspiracy theory right now. I think weather.com is run by the United Nations. I do. I think weather.com is run by the United Nations. I do. And I think that they put out weather warnings that are completely false to stimulate the economy. I do. I really believe it. Because they were telling us, go suck up on food, water, and toilet paper because everything's going to be shut down. Um, you're going to be stuck inside your house. No, you're not. No, we're not. No, we are Jenny not. Jenny P gifted a tier one sub to death bikes. Like, I don't they know. They have given 11 gift I just subs feel to the like, channel. Oh, this eclipse is going to be horrible. I'm not excited for the eclipse. Like, if you're in a wheelchair, you're definitely excited for the eclipse. But everyone else should not be excited. Like, it's going to just create so much stupidity. <laughs> like, I cannot. I cannot deal with it, girl. I cannot. Like, I don't want to see it. I don't want it to happen. I don't want other people to be happy because of it. Like, it's fucking stupid. I'm so excited. Well, we know why. I'm going to go look at it. I'm going to look directly into it for half a second. It better... I better see God. The way people ask, talk about these eclipses, it's like something cool is happening. What is cool about it, babe? Like, I just don't get it. What is cool about it? You're gonna go blind? Good. But I can get on disability. Thank you so much to Lulu for him. No, I saw this TikTok of this girl that said, you can look at it, but it'll burn a hole in your eye, but you'll be fine. And then she showed pictures of someone with holes in their eyes from looking at eclipses, but they're like, fine. Like, they can still see. So apparently you can look right at it. And it won't, it, you won't go blind. What isn't cool about it? Because, like, what is cool about it? Like, okay, I'm... The reason why I'm not excited about it, because ugh, I'm going to confess something. I'm a hater. Everything other people like, I have to not like it. I don't know what it is in me. I'm just a horrible person. And seeing everyone else be so excited about it makes me not, like, I just hate it because everyone else is excited about it. Like, I'm a hater down. I hate everything that people like on purpose to make them upset. <laughs> Person. But like, <laughs> no wonder you hate yes, but that's different. They're actually bad. Girl, and many WTF do you like and WTF are you excited for Jesus Christ? You're the most <laughs> negative bitch alive. Go pop a search <sighs> I'm not negative. All I'm saying, if you're in a wheelchair, you're excited for the solar eclipse. Other than that, you're just like being annoying about it. Because what is it going to do for you? How long is it going to last? Like eight minutes? Like, I don't know. I have to get some special glasses, I guess, to, like, look at it. 
see, it would be cool if it was gonna like destroy the earth or something, then I'd be excited about it. Not like kill everyone, I mean, I would never wish for that. But like, it was gonna do something. Like, if it was gonna do something, I'd be excited about it. But it's not gonna do anything, it's just something to look at. Like, if it was gonna like pull the oceans up out of the water, like something cool, you know? Like, next one in 2047, you'll be dead. No, I won't be. Maybe I'll be in a wheelchair and then it can cure me. So I'm just saying, like, I wish something cool was happening, you know, like, gravity would stop for a second, you know? You know, like, you know what, like, an eclipse is not as cool as a Fortnite event. It's not. Like, more stuff all happened during, in a Fortnite event. All the time off and you still event. don't stop talking. Like, all, like, more stuff happens in a Fortnite event than on Earth. Like, I got no tornado, the eclipse isn't gonna dry up the ocean, like, Jesus did not come on Easter, even though, allegedly, he's going to this year. Like, I hate Easter. I do. Easter was so boring because Publix was closed, so I couldn't go get any mac and cheese. Like, and for what? And for what? Jesus was not seen. Jesus didn't rise. At all. Like, I hate... You're so chronically online. I think... I, you know what? No. I'm chronically on a game. Online? No. Like, I, I hate online, honestly. And you know who's pushing me over the edge? Caitlyn Jenner. I hate Caitlyn Jenner. I do. I think Caitlyn Jenner is a horrible human being. I really do. <laughs> I told her on Twitter she's gonna die and nobody's gonna, nobody's gonna, what did I tell her? Jesus hates her or something? I don't know what I told her. I had to, she's just irritating me. <laughs> no, that wasn't my AC, that was my dryer. It's finally done. Also the dryer here is horrible. You have to pay extra to get a dryer and a washer inside your apartment. And we paid the extra for it, and it's horrible. I mean, you probably have to dry... We have to dry our clothes three times to get them to even be kind of dry. So probably in total, like, 15 hours. And then they'll be, like, kind of dry. But mind you, you can't run the dryer after 9 p.m. So unless you get up... And you can't run it before 7. So unless you get up at literally 7 a.m. and start running your dryer, you can't wash and dry in the same day. You don't have enough time. You're like, there's not enough hours of time outside of the quiet times. So like, comes nine o'clock, I should check the sheet. Nine or 10, I gotta go into quiet time. We gotta watch TV because I can't even talk in my own apartment or I'm gonna get yelled at again. So I don't know, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know, let it air dry. Babes, it's gonna be a tornado apparently. Like, let me go look, with a tornado? There's lightning. There's literally lightning. I just saw like a lightning. The way he walks. What's wrong with it? Gay walk? Well, I am gay, okay? I'm finally owning it. Oh, so that's been my past couple of days. Like, how are you guys doing? I know I said I was going to get on schedule, but with the past couple of days, I just couldn't. I just couldn't. And also, and also, my sleep schedule is messed up. I went about it like five in the morning. I literally go to bed at like five in the morning already. My schedule was already messed up. Like, oh, I feel unhuman living here. Like I feel literally unhuman living here. I literally feel like not even a human. No wonder you can't do your laundry. I know, I can't even do my laundry living here. My birthday's coming up, where are the Aries? Oh my God, Aries. Oh, and then another thing. You guys remember my old friend, Caitlin? She texted me and invited me to her birthday party. She said, I'm having a last minute birthday party early April because her birthday's in early April. Girl, I just fucking moved completely. She lives in California. So from Arizona, it's right next. And now I can't go because I just moved to the other side of America. So now I can't go. Like, girl, I can never win. Can you turn down the music? It's too loud. If you guys start saying that shit to me, I swear. So anyway, at any point during this stream, you might hear somebody banging on my door and tell me to shut up. Like, I don't, am I being loud right now? Because I really feel like I'm being very conscious to talk at like almost a normal but a whisper. Like, this is how I would normally talk. Hey guys, what's going on? Like, da -da -da. This is how I'm going to talk hey. while I'm streaming at this time. Like, oh, I need furniture, but I don't, there's no furniture stores. Like, I can go to Walmart, but I hate Walmart furniture. I had, like, two things of furniture from Walmart at my old apartment, and they were pieces of shit. There's no Ikea. There is no Ikea. There, it, it's, there is no Ikea. 
I'm gonna have to order from like Wayfair, I guess. I should look on Wayfair, not right, I'll do it after my stream. I should look on Wayfair, honestly. Are they cheap and affordable, but also like nice quality? Cause my issue is, is like, there's a Big Lots near me and there's a Marshalls. Marshalls sells furniture too. And, but you pay a lot for it, but it's like the shittiest fucking furniture ever. Like the thing I, I like about Ikea is it is piece of shit furniture. Like Ikea is horrible furniture, but it's not expensive. Like you're paying for what you get for. If you go to like Big Lots or like Marshalls or like JCPenney and get furniture, you pay so much, but the furniture is shitty. So I don't know. Yeah, I know Big Lots is bad. Oh, Timu. Ooh. I'm a blind person. I'm not going to risk blinding Ooh. you with my fanny fart. Timu could eat. Timu could eat your hair Hello, looks good. Nick, Thank since you. Hello, Nick. you hate Caitlyn Jenner as much as I do hop on my diss track against her that I made two years ago. I'm going to look it up. I need to hear some good music right now. Like, I don't know. Caitlyn Jenner. Uma Compton, Caitlyn Jenner. Girl, it doesn't come up. I feel like your video flopped. There's a Blair White video I talking about Caitlyn Jenner. You should play a horror game, game The Storm. It's quiet in the perfect setting. I think I was going to finish High School Dreams tonight. That was kind of my you plan. You should play a for horror tonight. game The Storm and Quiet. It's such a perfect setting, mama. Oh my god, I've been watching Hoarders. Hoarders is like the funniest fucking show ever. Oh my god, I love watching Hoarders. They have like full episodes on YouTube. I've been watching them when I go to bed. That show is so fucking funny, girl. Oh my god, those, there'll be like people with like roaches, literally the most roaches you've ever seen in your life. There was some lady on there, episode I last one, she must have been like a month from death. She must have been like a month from death, and she was a hoarder. And she was like literally tweaking, like she was literally like, she was like an old age, like, like literally tweaking. And then there's like a therapist there trying to like therapize her and be like, Oh yeah, let's talk about like why you feel like, this. like girl. You can't therapize this woman. Like she's like literally ninety years old, about to die, like tweaking. That's funny. No, it's okay. It was funny. Okay, no, her being like that was not funny. What was funny was the therapist was trying to like therapize her while that was happening. Like standing in the middle of her horde, being like trying to like get her to like open up and like. He was like getting angry with her and like lashing out at her a little bit, being like, why do you even want to keep all this stuff? And I was like, mama, this woman is like literally 90 years old and she's like tweaking off her pain medicine. Like you cannot. So that was funny because I was like, what is this guy fucking doing? I am like, he's begging like an for idiot. an online furniture shopping stream. <laughs> like, I was like, what is wrong with this guy? They ended up, did end up um, cleaning out her house and it did look really nice after, but I don't know why they were trying to therapize her so much. I was like, girl, she's not going to be able to take any of this in. Nice save. <laughs> you know what? I don't care. You know what? I don't care if you guys think I'm a good person or not. I've already said that I'm a bad person. Don't act shocked. Don't act shocked when I say I think it's funny that there's some woman tweaking out who's 90 years old, some man trying to therapize her in the middle of her horde. You I think it's funny. Like... <laughs> I'm a blind person. I'm not oh my god, Dorothy Doll. Dorothy Doll, I have a show for you to watch. Thank you so much, grocery store in Uma. What you need is them soundproof things you put Tweaking on the wall. Tweaking is a slur. Is you it? remember that simulator game you play where you had to buy furniture <laughs> from down the street for your empty ass apartment and adjust light switch? <sighs> it's giving that, but IRL. Guys. Clock that T burr burr. Okay, here's the real T. I'm not going to risk this is the one you guys know. If I don't stream for a week straight, I'm dead. Okay. If I don't shave for a week, I'm it's dead. Just know I'm never coming back because I'm dead. You already heard it, but paused it cause it was very okay. problematic and cut off that jewel. It's causing it's called, early dementia, sister. It's called cut it off, and you already heard it, but paused it because it was very problematic. Girl, I'm not putting it on stream. Then, like, here's the thing: I can't even laugh at an episode of Hoarders without the little gays coming for me. We are not listening to a song about Caitlyn Jenner called "Cut It Off." Like, it's just not gonna fly. <laughs> it's not gonna fly. Oh, Dorothy Doll, the show is called um. I saw a TikTok ad about it, and then also someone sent it to me on Discord. It's called Vanderpump Villa. Vanderpump Villa. It's a Lisa Vanderpump show, and it's very um, below deck coded. It's like okay, it's kind so of like. Okay, so Nick, um, can I please have my twenty dollars back from drawing yes. commission? Yes. I know you are just so busy. I'm kind of broke. <laughs> RN. Yes. Do I sound like you? You can have it back, Mama. JK, just send me JK, an email. Love you. Please, or message me somewhere. Like, please. I just don't know where to send it to. But definitely 100%, because babes are not finishing that, like, anytime soon or ever. Like, for real. It was giving scam. 
No, I I don't watch Vanderpump Rules. Although I've heard that show is good, but Dorothy Doll, it's called Vanderpump Villa. It's very below deck coded. Like, it's like um, there's like chefs, maids, um, like waitresses, and it's kind of like the same format of like where they get people to come in and like stay for a week, and then they like leave for a week. Like, I it's like you will love it. Honestly, it's so good. It's so good. Thank you so much, Hayes Girl. I really appreciate that. Thank you. It's called Vanderpump Villa. Hey, it's Vila. Hayes Girl Zero. I have news. I have become a milkmaid and I'm in the process of moving away to a valley off the grid. Hopefully I can get internet over there. I'm excited for this new adventure. Is that where you squeeze your tits and then men like drink the milk because they have mommy issues? What, what did I see that in? Was that the, the bad boys or was that American Horror Story? Because some men really like that. Like, if you are a milky kind of girl, you can, like, sell... Men will, sit, like, suck it out of you for money. You know what I'm saying? I would do it. If I could, I would. That was in the boys. I need to finish that show. Okay, let's play a game. I've yapped enough. Anyways, that's been my week. Like, it's not been good. A blind person. It's I'm just been really bad. Person. There's a Why traders game in development to be excited for. Out. Okay, yes, I will be playing that. I will definitely be playing that. Mine There's a traitor's kiss. Roblox game in development, okay. so be excited for the children to bug for it. Oh, I'll be playing it. Midas Touch Kiss of Life. I don't like Kiss of Life, because Matt told me that they're back so garbage. Is it out or just the trailer is out? Nobody knows me like you do. Is it out? Oh, just the teaser is out. Okay. Hold on, let me get it pulled up on my other monitor. Okay, um, teaser. Oh, that girl was eating. Oh, these girls are eating. Oh my god, these girls are literally eating. Oh, these girls are eating. That's cute. I like that. Those girls are literally eating. It's gonna be so good. I've never really listened to much of their music before, so I don't know. Oh my god, did you guys see this? This was so sick We're officially on our way to the swamp. I thought yeah, Dochi was going to quit music because she went so quiet for so long, resort. but this really is. Like, this really is. Listen to Nobody Knows. Is that Kiss of Lion? She hasn't said anything about music in so long. All her music is good. Everyone just on Twitter is saying this is an Azalea copy. I don't think it is though. <laughs> New Doja music on Friday. I think I saw that. I don't really care though. Like, do we still live for Doja? Like, I kind of don't care. I'll tune in. It's an Aisha erotica sample. I don't know any really any of the music. I, I I like that yummy remix. It was such a bad album cover. <laughs> I didn't see it. Oh, with her squatting. See, JT is who I love. Like honestly. Like JT is so sickening to me. I'm ready for JT's album, honestly. Like I'm ready for. Oh wait, Rico Nasty dropped a new song. I forgot about Rico Nasty. I used to love her so much. Is this song cute or no? Who? Are you kidding me? She was such an icon. This is cute. This is horrible. <laughs> she had like, so, okay, this song right here. This was like supposed to come out, but then like she posts, I remember, cause I used to be a big fan of her and she posted this video and then it got like deleted literally like an hour later. And then I don't know if this ever got re-released. I feel like this was meant to be a big song though. Like, I don't know. I feel like that, I don't know what happened there. Maybe there was like some legal troubles. Art misreaction? Is this Luna? This is Luna, right? It is? Yes, okay. You know what, I never really liked Luna that much, can I be honest? 
I liked a couple of their songs, but. Kim Lip? Oh my god. Not Kim Lip. Was she on that Netflix show or see that that's a different Kim Lip? I always thought that girl who was on that um Netflix show, what is it called? With Ke with Kevin, the failed model. What is that show called? And there's a girl in there named Kim Lip, and she's such an annoying bitch. I thought she was the girl from Luna. Bling Empire, yeah. But that's not her, is it? That's a different Kim Lip. That's not the other Kim Lip. Oh, okay. See, I thought Kim Lip was like um, a DJ and like a singer. And like... <laughs> anyway. Was <laughs> this gonna be Sam? Oh, this is so cute, though. <gasps> it's a metaphor because she was buried alive in her label and slapped across the face. Oh my god. That bang ain't working. <laughs> oh, yes. She looks so sickening. This video is really sickening now. No, the music video is sickening. This song is really bad though. You know, I do like K-pop, okay? It's just I never really liked Luna that much. I think Luna is like really boring. Which they are. Like Luna's good when they do that. They do like this other kind of music with this other group. Hi, called, like... fatty bum. <laughs> they do music with this other kind of bitches. What is it? Odd Eye, Cir Odd Eye Circle? I like that. I See, that kind of music I liked by them. Okay, yeah, I saw there's a new Baby Monster. I haven't streamed it yet, though. But Baby Monster is over. Like, they came and went. But I never liked Baby Monster. They're just, like, so shit. I haven't liked any of their songs. It's just fucking garbage. Baby Monster, sheesh. Like, here we fucking go. Sheesh. Rolly girl. Like, what's even going on here? The visual will be shit. The song will be shit. Like... Wait, pause. Is one who quit because her label forced her to get plastic surgery back in this? Is she back in the group now? I saw a cookie lit video that they took one girl out of the group because they forced her to get plastic surgery and now she's like coming back. She is back. Okay, that's cute. She also said the N word, okay. You know, a lot of these K-pop stars get exposed for saying the N-word. How do they know the N-word? Isn't that an English word, or am I so stupid? Like, where are they hearing it? That's what I don't understand. It is. It is an English word. It, oh, because they listen to English music? It's usually from songs. Okay, because it's, it's like a lot. Like in every group, there's at least one of them. It's like, oh yeah, this, there's a video of this girl saying the N-word. I'm just like, where did she even hear that? Like, which one is it? This girl here? <laughs> is it her? Not twice. Girl, there's literally a Nazi in twice. Oh, she looks good though. Can you play some real music for once like these people, Soldier Boy? Like OMG. Oh my god, these girls are so bad. <laughs> I'm half black and half Korean. A lot of Koreans are racist as fuck, really. I don't know nothing about Korea. I've seen a lot of videos about um, on TikTok about like, oh, like this is what it's like to be black and live in Japan. And apparently people are really racist there too. But I don't know nothing about, I don't know nothing about Korea. I, I learned about a little bit about North Korea when I was in high school, but that's it. 
You know what it is, I've been running this, pull up in a ghost, pick up, pick up, pull who? Run, 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 I want to like Baby Monster because, like, you know, how cute of them. It's such a, I, I love their group name, but that's about it. I love their group name, Baby Monster. That's such a cute little group name. But, oh, my God, the music is... I haven't liked any of their songs. Oh, my God, it's just so bad. Every song is just so fucking bad. No, I hate bad rap. I hate all of it. It's just noise. It's just noise me. But I always hated Blackpink, too. I hated Blackpink as well. Like, I thought Blackpink was garbage, except for a couple of songs when they stopped making Blackpink-sounding music. But you know what? These girls will be very successful and good for them. They probably have worked very, very hard. I've Oh, you guys, I caught up on all my Amberlynn Reed videos. She's losing a lot of weight. You know, she's really killing it. And have you guys been keeping up with Life Plus Cindy? Well, she was uploading videos like she was in a fucking cult. She was like making all these crazy weird videos, but she deleted them all. And I didn't even get to watch them all the way through. I haven't even got to finish them. Like... Something's going going on with Cindy. Something is going on with Cindy, I'm telling you. Like, she is in a cult. I think she might be in a cult. Like, I don't know. She She's not going to therapy, you don't think? Because something is going on. Like, she was, like, making all these weird videos about, like, how I changed myself into a positive mental attitude overnight, and you can do it, too. Here's how. Like, you know, that gives me, like, cult or, like, MLM shit, you know? Like... I don't know. It, it, it was good. I watched her morning routine video, Girl at 8. She's so queeny. Like, I loved watching her morning routine video. <laughs> this video was sickening, babes. Like, this video 8. She was doing some yoga here. Yes. My favorite part is when she's praying at her altar. I'm not going to risk blinding you with my fanny pack. Into my mind, I just let them flow in and out. I don't concentrate on This is on what I need to do. It's my birthday today, so I thought I'd donate. I, what... I was oh, gonna use so my much. birthday money to donate more, but I used it all. Girl, keep your birthday money for you. Thank you so much, Helen. We have an amazing birthday. I'd sing you happy birthday, but it's too late and I'll get evicted. I connect with the divine source, God. Like, she's so queen. I swear they make a song about every word and sound like, bitch, damn, what's next, Sonic? Boom, helicopter jump, whiplash, <laughs> moldy cheese, bang bang diaper, are you jumping, delulu, la la loopsy, ugly duckling, you pee, <laughs> like damn. <laughs> Whenever I was first finding out about K-pop, I thought the same thing. But it, it's been better recently, but like back in the day when it was like black, pink and twice, it was like cheese, refrigerator. Doorknob, say hello, tablecloth, like, <laughs> like they just pick a random fight and then it has nothing to do with the song. And then it has nothing to do with the song. Like it's been better now, but back in the day, like the older K-pop groups, like they were really guilty of it. Like, I don't know. <laughs> doorknob, doorknob. Like, I don't know what the hell those bitches were singing about, but I was living for it, so... <laughs> And B you know what? BTS is guilty too. BTS is guilty too. Golden. You know what? BTS picked every fucking color in the rainbow. Red. Gold. <laughs> do, 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 do. Going and going and going. Like, oh my god. Every song. Every song. I miss BTS though. I do. I do miss BTS. Okay, let's play a game. Let's play a fucking game, okay? Like, let's play a fucking game. I think there's nothing else I want to talk about. I feel like there's more things that I've seen that I wanted to talk about though. But no, I just can't think of it. I think I'm gonna play um, High School Dreams. Oh, I found the server for Red Dead RP that I'm gonna be applying to. I'm gonna try and get my application in tonight. I did some, I, I messaged my friend Bonnie and I messaged Cal. Let me see if Cal messaged me back, hold on. Okay, hold on, Cal messaged me back. There's a new one coming out sometime this month. Okay. Should I wait for the new one then? Because Bonnie sent me one called Frontier, which is apparently good. So I was going to apply to that. Yeah, I saw your message, Dorothy Doll. I saw your message. Mama Clock into Prodigy. Okay, well, Council of One's coming up. Oh, I don't know. I'm not sure. You can't be there for its release, so it won't be played out. I guess you're right. I should maybe wait. Okay. 
I'll message Cal back after my stream. Oh, here's Matt tweeting some fucking K-pop shit. Matt, you have the worst fucking tweets in the world. Like, it's always some dumb shit. And you know what? Matt's always fighting. Matt's Twitter is on private, and he's always fighting with bitches who are not on private. Like, babe, they can't see your <laughs> I'll see Matt's tweet, and he'll be, like, gagging some bitch. I'm like, girl, I can't even see that, babe. <laughs> it's a th I'll be, like, in bed, about to go to bed at, like, 3 a.m., and I'll see, like, Matt tweet from five hours ago, and it's, like, gagging some bitch. But baby, you're on private. <laughs> I forgot to tell you how good you look today. The new Thank era so of the much, new town Hayes, is girl. suiting you. Want to have sex later? Oh yeah, sure. I'm thinking of becoming a sex worker. I feel like when you're out here in the country, being a sex worker is a really good way to make money. No, Matt is so annoying. Matt will tweet something. Mind you, he's on private. So only his like 10 followers can like it. And it will get two likes and he'll quote it and be like, viral tweet. Babes, that's just your followers liking your fucking tweets, babes. <laughs> like, your tweet can't go viral, babe. You're on private. <laughs> that, no. Like, it, it is every day. It's every fucking day, girl. <laughs> high school dreams. Yeah, I think I'm going to play it. Are, are, are you guys down for high school dreams? Are we down for some high school dreams? I'm kind of sweating. I need to put my AC up. Hold on. You guys make me nervous. Like, honestly, you guys give me so much anxiety. It's true. You guys do give me so much anxiety. You guys literally send me spiraling into fucking anxiety, and I just want to fucking eat my own shit. I've been having the biggest shit since I moved here. Okay, I haven't eaten. I don't eat takeout anymore. I have a conspiracy. I'm going to get my high school dreams up. <laughs> Yeah, there, there is a new DVD mode where, like, you get stepped on. I saw that. Can you see Bulge in it or not? Because if you can't, I'm not playing it. We need another storyline on eviction notice, Mama. The choice is clear. I know. I'm going to do probably Roblox next time, but I need to do my Bayonetta stream, too. I need to go live early one day and do my Bayonetta stream. Y-E-O-U-C-H. <laughs> I want to play the new DVD game mode, but only if you can verse the male killer and, like, they can, like, vore you and also, like, have their big dick out and, like, step on you and, like, big bulge and, like, they swallow you. Because I would love to get vored. If I could get vored in real life, I would 100% let it happen to me. Like, 100%. Like, but I, I wish I could be a liquid, you know? Like, you could get swallowed by a man when he, like, pees you out. Isn't that kind of sexy? Right? Like, isn't like, mm, yeah, like, swallow me up and then, like, spit me out. Like, pee me out. Like, period. I'm not going to risk blinding you <laughs> with my fanfare. Since I'm getting fired tomorrow. Babes, why are you getting fired? What is going on with your guys' jobs? Good night, Mama. I'm gonna rest early since I'm getting <laughs> fired tomorrow. <laughs> why are all you guys getting laid off, your hours cut, and getting fired? Like, what's going on? Is this a conspiracy theory? High school dreams, salupus kidney, salupus kidney. You know what they played in that new, um... Vanderpump Vila show, they played that new Selena Gomez song. Why was that new Selena Gomez song not a hit? I'm like so confused by that. Microsoft Ping, chat with GPT-4 for Chrome. Girl, I'm not doing this AI shit. Like, please, I'm so over AI. AI is so boring, girl. Anyway, here's some AI images of Lady Gaga eating mashed potatoes. She looks sickening in this one, babe. Like, oh yeah. She looks good there. This is the Lady Gaga we need. Like, she looks so good there. I have better ones, like this one of her, like, collapsing on a potato. <laughs> Hi, Nick. Happy late April Fool's less than three high chat. I know. Hope you're I wanted to do an April day. Fool's joke, but I feel like I'm becoming a little bit out of touch. You know, like, I opened up my stream and I was talking about how I was laughing at an episode of Hoarders and everyone started coming at me. So maybe I'm just losing touch. Like, I was going to do an, an April Fool's joke about how, like, my little sister was kidnapped. Like, what, um... I was gonna do a April Fool's joke. I wanted to get on and be like, yeah, Autumn was kidnapped. Like, she's been missing for like three days. I don't know what to do. Like, but I feel like you guys would be like, get mad at me. But you guys used to let me get away with everything. And now I guess you're all growing up or something. I don't know. I'm not going to oh my God, Mother Nix, Amazon, don't. <laughs> you're gonna get arrested, babe. Okay, where's my high school Amazon dreams? don't play when you steal from them, I guess. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> What is this? Where is my high school dreams at? <laughs> like, honestly. Hold on. We need a new puppet combo game. Hi, That's Nick. I'm back play. from class. How are you? I'm doing good, Marshy. How are you? I'm doing bad. High school dreams. High school dreams. 
High school dreams. High school dreams. You know what they should do on Twitch that would make Twitch such a better place? Oh, I found it. They need to start allowing sex games on Twitch, and you can just mark your game as 18 plus. Not because I want to play like a sex game, but I really want to play some furry games. Because I think they're just so funny. Like, I just think furries are so nice and so funny. Like, I would love to play some furry games on stream, you know? Like, funny ones. Like, that would literally eat. There is a new Chilla's Art game, but girl, it has horrible reviews. Like, I don't even want to play it. Because it has literally horrible reviews. Okay, I'm opening up my high school dreams right now. And you will have zero viewers. That is not true. <laughs> that bitches can have their yennies and laurels out. Girl, I don't, it doesn't bother me, honestly. I gotta put in my serial code Stop again. Stop talking about your perverse fantasies on stream challenge anyways. Mama K-I-S-S-Y-S. Make some noise. Be prepared for the comeback of Kiss of Life. Single Midas touch out tomorrow. Teaser oh, on YouTube right now. Y-A-S-S-S-K-I-S-S-Y-S. -S 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 -S. If you're a real kissy, you are that that girl. Okay, hold on, I gotta get- I'm scared my save file is gone, you guys. So scared my save is gone now. Okay, we're gone. We're gone. We're gone. Okay, I think we can beat this game tonight, though, honestly, you guys. Like, I feel like... What was even going on last time whenever we played this? So we're going for the school shooter. Fuck, like, what was I even doing? Feels good, I just can't get enough, can't get enough of it feels so good. Yeah, we went on a date. Oh, that's right. Eugene told me he's moving countries. He's going on. He's going to move to Japan to teach English, <sighs> which I think is a huge red flag. Holy fuck! I look fat and ugly. What the fuck am I wearing? Is this what I wore to my fucking date? There is no way this is what I wore to my fucking date. Oh my god, ew, I look disgusting. What is this hair? Also, why is my room such a fucking mess? Okay, hold on, let me get it together. Does this mean 9 a.m. or is this like 9 p.m. military time or something? Is it morning? Oh no, what's going on? Now, see, now it's been too long and I don't know what's going on. I have nothing in my calendar. It's Sunday, so I have school tomorrow. Like, what the fuck? Where's my quest? Use the telescope on the promenade. I'm not helping Benny. Petey. Okay, I went on my date. Like, maybe I should go work and decorate my room. Because tomorrow at school we can talk to Eugene and see if we can go to prom. Do you think you're too old to be playing this game? No, I don't. I'm only 17. I still go to high school every day. This room, I don't know. Okay, let's change our outfit because this is like really bad, babe. Like, we're not wearing this. This is just horrible. 
Okay, what's my store? This is my store. <sighs> okay, let's do this. No, let's do this. This is cute. This is giving like, yeah, I have a pet hamster. I let it crawl on me in inappropriate places. No, that doesn't work. Maybe like this. Okay. It's this hair though. Like this hair needs to go. It's really bad. That's cute. That's cute. Oh, that's fierce though. Bitch. Oh my fucking God, bitch. I'm fucking eating in this, bitch. Bitch. Oh, hell no. I'm about to solve a fucking murder, bitch. J fucking Nancy Drew style, bitch. This is eating. No, this is Italy eating. She looks cute. She looks cute. Okay, let's, let's go work. So what jobs? Does anyone remember what jobs I've mastered? Because you get special outfits. I've mastered... I'm not going to risk Thank you so much, Lexi. I really out. appreciate it. Hi, Queen. You want to hang out after this? I have no friends. Hi, Queen. Yeah, I mastered cleaners. I mastered ice cream. Did I master the ice skating? The roller skating. I'm so bad at the roller skating, though. I, a blind person, Thank you so much, Sana from Blackpink. I really appreciate you. I did. I want to play Bratz PS2 really bad. Nick, I love you so much, baby. Why are you gay? We could have been so happy together. I know, we could have. I just want to put a baby in Sauna from from Blackpink. Thank you so much. Lag, lagging out. I'm lagging out. Doesn't this guy have a pedophile storyline? Oh my god, I watched that Nickelodeon documentary. I did. It was very disturbing. It was very, very disturbing. I need to watch, Dan Schneider made a YouTube video with the guy from iCarly, which I was so shocked about. Like, I was like, why would he do that? Especially since like cast members that he was close with came forward about like what happened. Oh, Sakarin's out here. Hello, darling. Um, hold on, let me not just stand still. Oh my God, no, it was terrible. It was actually really bad, and Amanda Bynes wasn't in it, which I'm glad she wasn't in it because I, a, a, a lot, I like was deep diving it a little bit on Twitter, and like people were like, "Oh, it's so gross that Amanda Bynes isn't speaking up," and like all this stuff. But like, why does she have to? Like, it's not gonna do. Like one thing that people don't understand, I feel, is like when you're when you went through something very traumatic, it can be very healing for a lot of people to like speak that truth and like stand forward. But that's not everybody, girl. Like not everybody wants to relive those memories and then be judged for them online. So if she doesn't want to do it, why would she even do it, right? Like, oh, we only did bronze on this. But anyway, the guy from I Carly did the video with Dan Schneider. I need to watch that so because apparently Dan replied to it. But this is my opinion and then I'll move on because I don't want to talk about this so much. It's so sad, but Throughout the documentary, they kept showing, um, like, uh, Dan said he didn't know about this. Dan said it was never a factor. Dan said this. Dan said that. My first thought is, how could that possibly be your defense? A, if everybody else knows about it and you don't, you're probably lying. And if you're not lying, it's almost worse that you didn't know and you didn't care enough to even pay attention like all these kids were getting molested and sexually assaulted all around you and you didn't know that's almost worse babe like that means you were just turning a blind eye and were clueless to what was going on you were not trying to protect those kids at all like girl it's a lose lose own it like I, I don't I didn't get why that was his offense but he made a YouTube video with the guy from my Carly I need to watch it I haven't watched it yet where he like responds to it they also had Drake Bell on there which I feel bad for Drake Bell because of you know his story was very sad but Drake Bell also sexually assaulted a 17-year-old girl. So I was like, I was a little bit like, like Drake Bell continued the cycle of abuse, but I still do feel bad for him for what happened to him, of course. But yeah. So yeah. He did, yeah, apparently he didn't know she was 17. It's the whole thing. I'm not going to come for his case or anything. I just thought it was weird. Apparently, I just thought it was, I just thought it was weird that they chose to have him on there considering his um, controversy. But I do still feel bad about what happened to him, of course. But he has, like, controversy. Anyway. Um, yeah, I got to watch that video, though, because... Girl, why would that girl from iCarly... Sam was on iCarly, right? I don't remember this game having this song. <laughs> okay. Oh, <laughs> okay. 
okay. <laughs> I don't really remember. Thank you so much. Okay, I don't really remember how to do this. TBH. Can hey, I start over? Do you want a Discord after this? Restart, restart. Elephant and okay. I'm screaming. I'm screaming, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, stop jumping. Okay, I don't know. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay. I got this, I got this. We're harding, we're harding. Flipping, flipping, flipping. Harding, dodging skull, get the start. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh fuck. Okay, I gotta use two hands. Oh my fucking god, it's like really crazy over here. And this is a safety hazard. Girl, I jumped over that. Are you fucking kidding me, bitch? And my form is bad. And my form is bad. Moving. Oh my god, this is um, um nomads, right? Moving. It's getting nomad, honey. It's getting a little nomad moment. Yes, it's getting moving. Okay, okay. Keep it going, girl. Keep it going, girl. You know this girl's a pussy because she wears a helmet while riding the rollerblades. Like, girl. You're either gonna risk brain cancer or you're a pussy. There's no in between. Like, wouldn't you rather risk the brain cancer? I would. Am I winning? What's going on? I can't rollerblade at all. Like, I wish I could because I think it's really sexy, but... It's not for me. I can't ice skate either, but I feel like only bottom, like strict bottoms are into ice skating, right? Or like Dutch girls. There's no in-between. It's like strict bottoms and Dutch girls. Like who else is... <sighs> oh, nomads, nomads. Where was the land bridge? Matt, where... Matt, where was the land bridge? I know your loser ass knows. It was like between Alaska and Africa or something. Russia and Alaska. Yeah, that's giving moving. Girl, you guys are distracting me and I'm missing all my good stuff. Ooh, the star. We need that. Thank you so much, Punchy. Okay, I got this in the bag. Moving. Can't sleep moving. until the storm's clear for the night, so thank you for streaming and giving me something to focus Punchy, on. Punchy, where are tomatoes. you? Oh I am Oh my god. You know what I learned about on TikTok? I need to get off TikTok so bad, but I'm addicted now. I, I learned about brain protein called prawns. And if you get it, you have a killing on you. You will do a, You will be killed if you have a prawn in your brain. And I'm like, girl, that's why I never wanted to eat seafood in my whole fucking life. And I'm very dead ass about that. Like, I don't fuck with seafood at all. And good thing, because it, if you get a prawn in your brain, it's like a bad protein and it will literally kill you 100%. And I'm not lying. Like, girl. I don't need the stars, babe. I got my 700 points. That's all you need. Like, I can't with that. Have you guys heard about that? Yeah, prawns. Oh. You wanna get in the bedroom, girl? Yeah, um, but you know what I also found out? That everyone who has cats have toxoplasma. Where are prawns from? I don't, apparently they're hereditary, but most of them are random. But if you get a prawn in your brain, you will die. It's like a twirly protein in your brain and it will kill you if you have prawns. So literally, like, no, don't eat shellfish. Don't eat, like, people eat, like, sushi. Like, I, I never had sushi. I've never, like, I don't even, I'll eat tuna, but now I won't even eat it anymore. Ever since I learned about it. Prawns, prions, whatever. Like, I just don't, I can't with that now. Like, I just cannot. Anyway, I killed that. You are so paranoid. Turkery has mercury. <laughs> Pry, prions are misfolded proteins. The other proteins to misfold. Yeah. And it's in prawns. Right? I want a seafood boil. I, but look, you can get this disease. Now you guys are fucking confusing me. Prions. They're dangerous, right? Who else craving crawfish now, girl? <laughs> I've never eaten a crawfish. Oh my god, my back is so fucking itchy. <laughs> oh my god. Crawfish is so good, unlike your pussy. Okay, should we just do this again and master it? I don't know if I have it in me. That one SpongeBob. SpongeBob is for people who are like so stupid. 
Like, literally. Why would you be watching Spongebob when you can watch, literally, the more iconic show, The Backyardigans? We all know The Backyardigans was so much better. Like, what did Spongebob do? Flip a hamburger? The Backyardigans literally invaded the ancient pyramids and, like, tormented pharaohs. Like, they were really queenies. Girl, Wonder Pets was cute, but it's like, girl... They wanted to be, like, superheroes, but, like, the lead of that show has a lifespan of, like, two years. Like, that little hamster thought he was going to do something. Babe, you're going to be dead soon. Like, your lifespan just does not going to... Like, I don't know what you think. I really don't know what you think. I watched Max and Ruby when I was a kid, but then my mom had a big issue with it because she thought it was really weird that there were no parents in that show. <laughs> like, that the, the rabbits were always, like, left alone. And they had no parents. So she didn't really like us watching it that much. Because they had no parents. I, a blind person, am not going to risk blinding you with my family. I think that's a guinea pig. I'll go on a rant about that in a second. Hello, this is one your neighbors in the apartment building. I've been getting a lot of noise complaints and been hearing a lot of weird noises coming from your apartment. It sounds like you're just talking to yourself. Is everything okay? I think I'm being quiet right now. I am literally talking quiet on purpose. You can hear it in my voice. Like, I am literally speaking in a manner where, like, I'm kind of whispering almost. Also, guinea pigs don't exist. Guinea pigs are hamsters that have that are literally of obese. Would you tell a fat girl that she's not a human because she's fat? That's really disrespectful. If a hamster gets fat, it's still a hamster. It's like disgusting that people even say this kind of shit. I'm in Kentucky, unfortunately. It's been crazy here today. Hope you and Quinn had a chill today. Yeah, girl, we didn't get anything, but they were telling us it was gonna be tornadoes, but I hope you stay safe. Look up a skinny pig mama. Yeah, picture are you gonna come up. Okay, here we go. This is the hard level. Let me focus. This is the hard level. Let me focus, babes. Oh, they're really coming for. Kill that. Kill that. Thank you so much, Summer Fun. You're such a fucking great. Good thing. Thank you so much for that. Look what you made song me. Song request. 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 God damn it! Fuck this country. Why is she going that way, Mama? Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. Oh my god! It's a bloodbath. Oh my god, that was like a little bullying almost. Like that made me feel really bad on the inside. Fucking hell. This is impossible. Okay, no, I got it. Who remembers Disney Skate? And you were like Simba on a skateboard? That game. That game kind of ate. Like, I don't know. Okay, we got this, we got this. All my years of playing Temple Run have led to this. Kill that, kill that. That's exactly where I needed to get stuff. If you land in the boxes, you should get a triple kill. We're almost halfway to our goal. We've got it, we've got it, girls. Okay. This is looking really bad. I don't know if I can... No, I got it, I got it. I chill. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Moving, moving, moving. Can I even get 400 points in one lap? Like, I don't think it's even possible. If I get every star, it's possible. There should still be like five stars left, so I should. God, no! God damn it! Leave me the fuck alone! Look what you made me fucking do! Now you just ruined my home run. Now you just ruined my whole fucking Hi, Nicholas. run. I hope you're doing well in Tennessee. I was. Until now. Like, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot for what you've done to this country. Oh, that, they tried to get you with that. Calculated, I got the star. Calculated, calculated. Who is putting all these boxes in the road? Like, girl, that's weird as fuck. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Oh, Jesus, fucking. Jesus, fuck.
You ate that? Girl. Pussy pink. Pussy pretty. Pussy little stinky. I'm going to the mall. Like, I'm gonna go- I'm, I'm gonna go do some- I'm gonna go do some laundrying. Like, I can't master these- What are the other jobs? There's ice cream, laundry. I think I beat the ice skating, right? Can you order the pug now? No, but I will be getting the pug. And I'm gonna name it, um, either Vicious or Pesticide. I'm gonna name it Vicious or Pesticide, depending on its personality. Why is this game lagging so much, bitch? Like, my computer's having a fucking meltdown. You look like a 50-year-old librarian. And you know 50-year-old librarians are some of the smartest people in the world. Also, I was on um, Goodreads the other night just trying to get some book recommendation for you guys. Which one of you bitches read The Bell Jar and then rated it one star? <laughs> one of you bitches read The Bell Jar and gave it one star and commented, boring. <laughs> Selma Body gifted a tier one sub to XXAWEEK. <laughs> Thank Kittens, you, Selma. I really XX. appreciate it. <laughs> girl. Like, girl, I was like, are you fucking kidding me? You guys are so stupid. Girl, let me in, you little gay guy. I love how there's no straight men in this game. I need some sodi pop for me. Access granted. Full level achieved. Activating hard mode. Perfection run. <sighs> turning. 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 Trick zone approaching. Get ready. He Nick I love when you like my Goodreads Left updates. Right. It makes me feel like a librarian. Left, right. God damn it, I fucking hate your... Just restart, because you can't win if you even miss one. You can't win. Like, you literally can't win. No, because this bitch lies for lunch. Want to get into my fucking ears? Talking about being a little librarian. Are you the one who voted Bell Jar one star? You know how anti-feminist that is of you? Can I be honest? I've never read the Bell Jar. Like, I, th I, I know some girl puts her head in the oven. <gasps> bitch, I will literally asphyxiate you. Okay, here we go, here we go. Focus up. Down left. Come on, come on, come on. Down right. I know that's right, I know that's right. That way. That was really bad. That was, I might not be able to, I might not be able to win off that. Calling Sylvia Plath some crazy lady, some girl. Hold on, I can't read. Cause look what you're making me kill women now. You're such a fucking anti-feminist. Can this bitch like, get a fucking hobby, girl? Oh my fucking god, you fucking nasty, snarky little fucking bitch. Okay, here we go, here we go. Here we go. I got this. That was a 6.0 period. That was really bad. That was really bad, but they threw an up at me. I'm not used to that. The up really threw me for a loop there. I feel like I'm not gonna win. Like, look! I'm sorry, that girl literally just merged in front of me with no fucking blinker. Like, honestly, if there was a baby in her car, that baby would be fucking dead. The bell jar is racist, though, is oh, it? Yeah. I've never even read. Oh my god. Please, someone adopt these children. They have no parents. Okay, here we go. W-B-E-S-S-E. W-B-E-S-S-E. W-B-E. Okay, okay. S-S-E. W B E S S C W B B S S E W B B S S C W B B S S E W B E S S E W B E S S E W B E T I C H D V D X T C H E T I C H D V D X T C H E Oh my god, five hundred dollars. T I C H D V D X T C H E. Let's go to the furniture store. T I C H D V D X T C H E. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. T I C H D V D X T C H E. Yeah, we're gonna wear a new outfit tomorrow. It's gonna be thickening. It's gonna be thickening. T I C H D V D X T C H E. Okay, so we didn't make a list. T I C H D V D X T C H E. This is the bed I have, right? And we hate this bed. Hey, babe. Hey. This is the bed we have, right? We hate this bed, though, right? Like, it's not. Oh, yeah, you my prom dress. You should dye your hair green again so you can have a broccoli sort of serve. I want to do neon red, really bad. 
Yeah, we hate this bed, right? I should have made a shopping list. I kind of like this bed though. But is this the starting bed? I like it. We like my, I have a nice bean bag, I think. I think we need this plant. Plant. I, it's not time for prom yet, I don't think. I think it's a little, I have um, one more date with Eugene. What did we need to buy? Can somebody from a new floor? We needed a new floor, that's right. And we needed like a new, a new wall, like a new wall thing in the back. Did I need a new one of these? Maybe we should go dark wood to match the bed though. Like, I don't know. Sack one, sack one, what's wrong, sack one? What are you, where are you going? Nowhere, I'm just freezing. You're freezing? Yeah. Why are you so freezing? It's so cold in here. Are you dying? Yeah. Am I being loud, babe? You think the neighbors can hear me? No. Okay. Babe's putting on socks right now, but babe is actually missing a foot, so he's having to pull it over his peg foot. <laughs> yeah, let's stop. Yeah, he has a stump because he used to have a ranch in New Mexico that his family saw, and actually a horse ran over it. No, he slipped in a bear trap. Oh, he slipped in a bear trap. And he was trying to invite me up there. Mind you, a serial killer used to be a neighbor to that. You can look it up. A neighbor no, he used to, to live in it. A serial killer used to live in Quinn's ranch on New Mexico. And he, like, what did he do? Trap women? In the basement. And he would play, like, recordings of himself, like, saying, like, demented shit to them. He and he would, like, do, torture them. Torturous things to them. Yeah. Yes. And Quinn actually wanted me to go stay there, where there's no service, and it's probably haunted as fuck. Because it's beautiful. You guys can look it up. He was called the Toy Box Killer. The Toy Box Killer. Quinn is related to the Toy Box Killer. I'm not related. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Quinn owns the ranch. Well, Quinn and his, Quinn's ranch. family owns the ranch, which he'll own it, because it'll get inherited <laughs> to him. Where the toy box killer murdered people. Oh my god, I knew it. How did you know that? <laughs> HII Mama, hope you're doing okay. <clears throat> Haven't been here in a while. You oh, thank you, Jules T. On as well. I don't want to listen to it. You, you know that really annoying girl that everyone loves and she like does makeup while talking about how their kids Bailey are dying? Sarian, yeah. Did a video on it. That annoying bitch, Bailey Sarayan, did a video on it if you guys want to know more. I hate that lady, but. One of the funny things is whenever that girl was an up-and-coming YouTuber, Bonnie was a really big fan of her. And Bonnie actually made her a YouTube banner, and she actually that. used I mean, it. She, still, she, she may not still use it, but she used it for a long time. Like, she literally used Bonnie's YouTube banner that she made for her. It was but really actually, funny. Like, she asked Bonnie to do yeah. it, Bonnie just made it. That was too funny. That shit is literally hilarious. Okay, what am I buying, you guys? Do I need a new end table? <laughs> Bailey is what? What are you trying to say, Jules T? What? What did she do? An abuser? Had to shower and fucking missed an hour of the stream. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Also, you look so twee today, Nick Dumbuds. I love you. Why are you showering for an hour, girl? I think 25, 30 minutes is all you need. Is enough time for you to cry? Purge? <laughs> okay, what, what, what do I need to buy? She's transphobic? Oh, after using a trans woman's art on her YouTube channel? Uh oh. Yeah, I hope you guys know Bonnie made her YouTube banner at one point. Okay, where... Where, um... <laughs> new floor. Okay, new floor. You spell, you spell. Hey, you wanna fuck me in the backseat of a fucking truck? Like, oh my god. I really wish I was a hedgehog. Okay, so what floor should we get, girls? See, I know you girls are gonna want this pink one. But, like, gross. Can I snatch a jewel charger? Yeah, it's right here. Like, the pink, I think we should do some wood. Thank you. Like, if we did wood, I think it would be really cute. You wanna come in? Come on. $200 for that. Maybe we should do carpet. Yeah. There's tile. I think this blue carpet with the stars might be really cute. What do you guys think? This blue one or this darker wood? We can't do the light wood. Dark wood, blue, or tile. The pink is gonna look atrocious, babe. The pink is gonna be, a d the stainless steel floor might be cute, huh? The blue might be cute too, like blue and pink moment. Going for a boy room? Well, you know, I'm not like other girls. Like I read and I'm, I have brains. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah, let's do the blue. You guys spelled. Saccharine, you're gonna get put on the balcony again. I'm just kidding, we never put her on the balcony. Is it stormy? It is, I just saw lightning. Okay, be careful out there. There's mosquitoes. 
I feel like this one is really cunty. Like, thank you so much, grocery store. See, this would match. This is like, this is getting like tramp stamp, right? Reminds me how my meme off was neighbors with a murderer. He was hosting a yard sale and she kept giving him sus looks and he'd give them back. But he'd hold the yard sales to lure PPL and kill them. She said, I K N E W it. I knew he was a killer. Forgot name. That's so fucking creepy. Oh, and that Nickelodeon doc of when that guy was pen pals with John Wayne Gacy, that little boy toucher. That was really creepy. Anyway, should we, should we get this tramp stamp on our wall or this daisy? I think we have the pink one now and it's really ugly. I feel like this is the one I wanted though. This like blue one. Wh which one out of these three? Maybe the daisy's like the most neutral. It, girl, the daisy, right, Miss Kitty Hole? Stars will match the carpet. You guys don't like the this like tramp stamp at all? This one's cute, and I have the matching bean bag. The stars for a solar eclipse. Oh yeah, let's put ourselves in a wheelchair. Okay, see, but like, how do you even, is this one not for sale? Like, I can't buy it. It literally won't let me buy this one. Like, I'm trying to get, like, pixel perfection here. Okay, we can't get that one. It's either the Tramp Stamp or the Daisy. Like, this one's unbuyable. Tramp Stamp or Daisy. Tramp Stamp. Change my camera angle. Is that better? Like, I don't know what you want from me, babe. <laughs> tramp Stamp. Okay, we'll do the Tramp Stamp. I like the Tramp Stamp. It is cute. Okay, how much money do we have? Do we need new walls? I can't remember. No, we have these pink walls, but they're like really fucking ugly, I feel. I wanna get these white walls. No, this floral one. Did we get new walls? Maybe red would be quite chic. No, the black would be chic. Let's do the black, it'll be chic. Yeah, this, see this, this like color combo kind of works here. You see this like three color combo right here? What new Fernie did we need? I think we needed like this. In the matching set, I think we bought this. But I kind of want to change to dark wood, because it'll match. Like, we should buy this. Oh, that's like all our money. Because our bed is, dirt, is, is like a dark wood. But our bed is also pink. I don't, no, I'm not gonna stream hoarders because I'm gonna get canceled if I laugh at the people on there. But I just can't help it, like I'm a really sick individual. Is this good, you guys? Like, ugh. let's buy it. You know, let's just see what happens. I don't know. Like, let's just see what happens. Thank you for your business. <laughs> like, I don't know. We'll give it a try. We'll give it a fucking try, okay? If it's ugly as fuck, I can just blame you guys because you guys picked pretty much everything. Well, uh. I'm beat. I think it's time for bed. It's really sunny as day out, but sure, babe. Okay, let's try. No, I didn't need to buy this. I needed to buy this. But I bought another one of these. God damn it. This, see, this is the one I needed to fucking buy, you guys. See this one? Okay, let's change the floors. Okay, so we got new floors. Oh, that's a sight. <laughs> um, okay, we got new walls, though. That might help. How do I change? Oh, here we go. Okay, pictures. We got the tramp stamp. That does match the floors. And the walls. Cute? Are you fucking lying to me, bitch? And then my headphones turned off. <laughs> Girl, because the reason why it's so ugly is because I just don't know what we're going for. And you guys don't fucking help me with shit. Like, we need to get a new- Okay, someone type this in the chat. Radio shelf. 
and we need new bookcase. So what are we going for? What's the vision? I don't know, bitch. I gotta restart my game because my headphones randomly turned off. I'm gonna put them so it doesn't happen again. It'll save after we sleep, though. We need no concept, no gorgeousness. Do people actually have concepts for furnishing their house? Like, that is such a rich person thing. Like, hello? Is she dead in her fucking bed? She fucking died. The room was so fucking ugly that she fucking died. She fucking died in her ugly boy room. Looking like a boy. Tell him to bring out the lobster! <laughs> she fucking died. No, it will, I think it'll save after the minigame. I'll restart it. You know what, maybe we won't be able to, have, we won't have to buy that furniture this time. We can make different decisions. Because you got, now I know you guys have no fucking taste at all. And I won't trust you guys to make the decision. I'll make the decision myself on what we end up having. Because I just know you guys have horrible fucking taste. Like, I'll figure it out. I'm going to make my own choices. No one is making choices for me anymore. Okay, here we go. I did not make the fucking choices. I did not make the fucking choices. You guys chose the the tramp stamp. It was a mess. This the floor, a mess. Spring. Okay, let's see. Where did it leave us off? Look like a fucking splice baby here. <sighs> this gets like one of the hardest games ever. You know how those guys do like those runs on Elden Ring? It's like no death. This game is harder. This is one of the hardest games you will ever play. Because the furniture store is just laid out so bad. Like, no, it is. Hi, Amish girl, how are you? Apparently some Amish girl on TikTok died. Like, what? and everyone was shocked. When her cult finds out she's using a phone, she's gonna get hanged and burned at the stake. Like, what do you it's mean? getting late. God I damn it, I bought the fucking furniture. I bought all that fucking furniture. Okay. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do, okay? We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. Let's do, this pink wall is, I hate the, no. We're gonna do the pink wall. We're gonna do, we're gonna do the tramp stamp. Okay. Let's do the Scandinavian chic. Okay. Get rid of all of this. Put the desk there. The beanie here. And the plant here. I a blind is this cuter? To risk blinding you with my is this cuter? This is like a little better. I love how the automated voice says mama su mama 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 that's um when a lady walks into the orphanage and all the kids are trying to get to try to get adopted. That's what it sounds like. Okay, let's do the black wall. I think you guys are right. This wall isn't eating. Girl, this is like literally disgusting, bitch. This is literally fucking disgusting. Like, none of this matches. <laughs> like, oh my god, my magnets. Oh my god, spill. None of this fucking matches. This all looks really fucking bad. Like, this looks really stupid. Wait, what's over here? Excuse me? Wait, why is there a window into my bed? Are we a science experiment? There's windows from the inside of this room into my bedroom. Oh my God. Wait, this is like the Truman Show. I have to tell Emily about this. Like, it's called the outside. Oh yeah, do you have carpet and this wallpaper and this painting in the outside of your house, bitch? Hurricane season ripped your damn door off. I don't know. Go to bed, bitch. Please don't die tonight. Okay. No, I'm gonna go buy new stuff tomorrow. Like, I'm gonna go talk to Eugene and I'm gonna go buy new, I gotta go make some money. I have to maximize. Oh. I think I've maximized like every game. Laundry is the easiest. I'm doing fucking laundry and I'm just gonna make my money even fucking laundry, like a queen. Okay, where's my new outfit? Oh, I just thought, okay, this is my new outfit, you guys. This is my new ice skating outfit I got. It's kind of chic if you think about it in a weird like feminist kind of way. 
Imagine I had a pink belt to go with this. This would be literally sickening, bitch. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on. We can make something happen with this look. Like, this is kind of cute. It's really chic. Okay. And then we do the pink hair. Like a pink pony moment. And then we'll do like our pink eyes. Where the fuck are my pink eyes? Oh, I had blue. We have blue might eat here though. Blue might really eat here with the pink rose. Is this chic? Is this really chic, you guys? This is Aldi Shadow Lady if she wasn't by. She's eating, she's kinda eating. It's kinda giving like chic moment. I'm shrieking in horror. Bitch, you're gonna get kidnapped. <laughs> Give her brown. The blue is kinda like chic though. It's doing like chic. Okay, maybe just a different hairstyle. But the hair color I think is eating. I don't like this hair, it's ugly. Maybe we need the bangs. This one is just so chic though. The Emily hair. This one's kind of cute. Okay, this is cute. And then you guys want brown eyes. That is a bit more natural, I guess. Let's put a little ring on. That's cute. You know what, I think it's the flower. The flower is like a different, it is a matching color, but it's like a totally different vibe. Like I think this yellow butterfly would go better. Thoughts? The outfit mama, what do you mean? The pink, the pink hair is really cute. It's giving like a good high quality sheen wig with no part. Different outfit, girl, this is my new outfit. I'm definitely wearing this. I can change the bell. That's kind of cute. We could do no bell. No bell looks so weird. We could do like a goth moment with this. Hold on. What if it's like a little goth moment with this or something? Hold on. Wait, that's kind of giving me like pop star moment. Hold on, let's do like a pop star moment, like a little Ariana moment. <gasps> Wait, okay, hold on. Let's do like Ariani moment. Like I just ruined a marriage and made kids, two kids have no dad. Like, wait, this might really eat, though. Is this sickening? This is kind of sickening. This is kind of sickening. I didn't wear this on the date. My This is my date dress right here. My, that, my like, that thousand dollar date dress. No, this is giving really cute. This is giving, like, I have Evan Peters in a music video even though he abused Halsey. Right? This is cute. Let's do this. It's giving, babe. Gotta go to fucking school. Okay, here we go. I saw this statistic online that like 30% of kids these days are chronically absent from school. Are any of you high schoolers, do you guys just not go? Like, does, it, does everyone just not go to school anymore? I know school's a thing of the past because education doesn't matter. Okay, I'm gonna talk to my man. Like, I look really cute today, so. He better love on this. I dropped out, my siblings, I dropped out and I'm homeschooled now. I had 80 absences and had to go to court last year. What the fuck, really? I, yeah, like, I don't know where I stand on it. Like I think kids should have to go to school, but I hate that the parents get charged with like child neglect if the kid doesn't go. Like some kids have mental health issues, bitch. Hey, you wanna fuck me? Okay, what's up? <laughs> oh, hey. Perfect timing. Hey, beautiful. My spidey sense told me someone oh needed help. Comic book humor. Nice. My professor clocked so that I anyway, used AI. Oh my god, you you're a bad person. I have to do the fashion portfolio, right? Yeah. Well, I need someone to model for me. Oh, cool. I'd love to help. What do you want me to do? Set up lights? Um. Is he gonna do like a little exactly. nudist shoot at me? Your makeup artist? Not quite. I. Who the fuck is I'd that like lady? I'd like you to be the model. Can someone make a deep fake nude of Eugene? <laughs> Be flattered. Finally, someone has recognized my talents. But there's no way I can do it in these clothes. They're too blah. I'll run home real quick and change. No, no. I've been saving up for this, and I thought, if you're okay with it... He's not a high schooler. This is college. After the shoot, you can keep whatever you like. They won't do me any good. Free clothes? I think that's the nicest thing He better put me in some cute outfits, like honestly. Well, is this that is yes? not 10th grade. He's going to Japan in like six months. 
Yes. Oh okay, but anyway, gosh, I'm joking. Yes. Like, I'm really joking. You have me at, you can keep whatever you like. Yeah, you'd oh like my that. god. Here's the money, let's go. Wait, he's giving us money to shop? Lady, can you get the fuck out of here with your disgusting, like, yoga pants? Like, what the fuck are those? This girl's so sickening. Oh, look at her heart. Oh, you guys can't see it. There's an arrow through it. He really loves me. Okay, where are we going? Okay, so what kind of look are you going for? Okay, here we go. A hot look. I trust your judgment. The so he wants look, something slutty? Up. Wait, he gave me $100? Is he serious? I can get a belt with that. Men are so fucking stupid. He gave me $100? What the fuck am I going to do with that? I can go buy a pair of shoes. Um, no, this isn't good. I, I should, should just get my hair done. <laughs> okay, so what's the hot look? Like, party on? Like, this is giving, like, sexy, like, slutty. This is, like, a grandma blouse, but this is so Sims 1 outfit. Okay, let's... L How let's can get a I help you? Hey. Okay, so what's giving sexy, you guys, on a budget, though? Because I'm broke as fuck. Okay, like... This is all, like, ugly as fuck, actually. Ew, like, I, this is all really, uh, um, I don't know, I don't know about this. This store isn't gonna work, yeah, this is even, like, British fashion, which is not good, so let's leave. No, I would like to leave, like, I'm not shopping here. See you here. soon. It's not eating, it's not eating, we'll go somewhere else. That's not the hot look. This is like giving Kobe Calais bubbly moment. We don't need that. That girl was poking her ass out so bad. Like, girl, get a fucking job. Big game? No. I don't know where to shop for this look, though. Maybe as a fish? Like, I don't know. You think he'll buy me a $1,000 prom dress? <laughs> Saccharine, you can't crawl right here because otherwise the catnapper will come and arrest you. Do you think he'll buy me, like, a, a prom dress? Go to As a Fish? Okay. He's gonna hate this, though, and break up with me. Then you guys are gonna ruin my playthrough. Let's try it out. Oh, here we If fuck. there's anything I can do for you, just yell for help. <sighs> Little Marilyn. Wait, that, that look behind him is kind of giving, though. This, like, long black... Wait, how, where is that? I want that look. That's kind of sickening, though. It's giving, like, Evanescence. Wait, this with like the, the fishnets? That's kind of hot, right? Like fishnet leggings and like a little skirt. That's kind of cute. It's 80 bucks, so it's like most of my money. Who the fuck is wearing this like parts of the Caribbean fit? Here's the matching top, but I kind of like this, but it's not very slutty. They have such little skirts here, like, oh my god. Maybe he'll just front the whole bill. Like, I really want to get this, and I really want this, and I really want this, and I really want this, and this, and I also really, really want, um, this. I want this, and I also want this. Will he foot the bill? Let's see. <laughs> he better foot the bill, girl. Almost four years. Less Thank than you three. so much, Nia. I hope you're having an amazing night and staying safe out there. He hates everything. He said he doesn't care what I buy as long as I'm happy. Did he really give me a hundred dollars? I make literally five times that ice skating in one night. Okay. Well, what should we get? The little mi okay. What should we get, you guys? The little yellow mini skirt or this with the fishnets? Mini skirt or fishnets? I think these are the slut. Like these ones are not slutty enough. We won't get those. Fishnets. Okay, and so then we we're gonna need a top that's like essentially free. Can I even afford like this fifty dollar top? I I wish I could get this sixty dollar top. Thank you so much, head barb. Lato over. Take off the red and black like. I want this shirt, but I can't afford it because I'm a dollar short. You can't just spare the dollar. This isn't even going to match, girl. 
Like, hold on, we gotta find a different top that's, like, cheaper. 55, 50, how much do I have? Like, I can spend like $40 on a shirt. Where did I even find that cheap? No, I can spend $50 on a shirt, okay. So what, what should we got? That one's too much. That one's only 50. That one's too much. A hundred for a t-shirt with a... What about this? What about this one? Can I put some of this shit back? Cause I clearly can't afford it. Like I wish I could shoplift in this store. Try it on. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Zachary, you can't jump up here. I'm so sorry, girl. Okay, let's see. So I'm thinking of this. We'll have to get different shoes from home. <laughs> and then this is what, what we can afford. This is literally ugly as fuck, girl. Rajanilal gifted a tier one sub to Little Miss Kitty Hole. This is their first gift sub in the channel. Well, does he like it? Can he say something, girl? Like, I'm just itching my ass like Taylor Swift on stage. Yeah, maybe it's the mini skirt. Oh, why is it so floofy? <sighs> girl. That mini skirt is hideous. What about this skirt? Why are they all so floofy? This shirt is really cute. <gasps> See, that's so cute. We need to get that. That shirt is actually really cute, though. That is so bad. I'm not buying that. No, just take everything out of my basket. Like, I don't want any of this. Honestly, I don't I don't want a single like here I'm gonna buy this black shirt. I mean this blue shirt and nothing else. Like I like this shirt, that's it. Like I don't want this, 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 or this. I'll buy this shirt. I really dig your style, man. Like, it's slutty and it's cute. We can't afford the heart shirt in the fish now. Thanks for shopping it as a fish. Now I'm gonna go to the cheerleader store and get a little cheerleading mini skirt with my fifty-four dollars. That's Okay, come on, let's go. We're gonna make this work, don't worry. We're gonna make this work. If there's work. anything I can do for you, please let me know. Like, we're gonna make this work. Where's the little cheerleading skirts? Well, where the fuck are they? $60? I don't have $60. Like, I can't afford anything in fucking dick Sporting Goods. Okay, this isn't gonna work. Where's the thrift store? Thanks for shopping at Big Game. Eugene hates everything because he's a fucking hater. But he's hung, so we just deal with it. Jeannies. Like, I don't want to wear jeans. Jeans are not sexy. Jeans are so formal. Like, oh my god, he's so broke. Like, I cannot. Customers are reminded that the mall closes at 10 p.m. Thank you for your patronage. I'm sorry to say it. But I think I'm done. Excellent. Get changed, do what you need to do, and meet me back at the school. I got- oh, See you He's then. such a piece of shit. Like, I hate you, Gita, after this. He gave me a hundred- I look like a fucking idiot in this store. Walk around, all my friends are here. I look like a fucking idiot because my boyfriend can't even buy me a fucking skirt. <laughs> my room still looks like- I don't even know. It's even like Jumanji or something. Like, I don't know. Teleport to a different fucking universe. I don't fucking know, bitch. This is what Jojo Siwa's room looks like. Because she's mid-transition from, like, being a lesbian goth, like, stud from, like, a little pink princess dancer girl. Like, that's, like, what my room is giving. Like, it's, like, midway Jojo Siwa from her old era to her new one. It looks a disaster. Okay, where's my new outfit? So this is my new shirt. This is cute and it's slutty. Like it shows like my mid drift off. But what are we gonna wear with this? Not this fucking belt. I can tell you that. Maybe like some sandals. And then like what? This grandma skirt? <laughs> Mama. Mama. Wait, what is this? This is kind of cute. Wait, this is kind of cute though. Is this cute? We could do the yellow skirt. It needs to be slutty though. He said he wants slutty. Not my prom dress. Like he wants, maybe like these. <laughs> I 
I do have black shoes, but they're not really that cute. Like, they're like giving grandma. Maybe we should just do this. Is this cute? Is this cute, you guys? And don't lie. Just do the yellow skirt with it. I feel like it doesn't match. <laughs> like... <laughs> I feel like it doesn't look that good. This is kind of cute, I guess. <laughs> jeans are not sexy. Like, how- jeans are not sexy. Like, I'm gonna put on a pair of jeans. That is not sexy. Like, that is cute though, you kind of spelled. This is kind of sexy, I mean, this is cute. It's not really slutty, but it's cute. I have a dark wash too. No, I like I, I like the white the white wash. It kind of ends. Cargo shorts are super sexy. <laughs> oh my god, this is really bad because my man is broke. Like, what the fuck? If I was eating Landon, he would have given me like five hundred dollars. I should just break up with this guy. He's too broke. What about this? This is like kind of his style. Oh my fucking god, that is so ugly. This top is really cute though. Okay, let's do the boots. Let's do the boots and then let's do the, the this skirt. Is this cute? <laughs> Shut the fuck up, let me figure it out. This is kind of cute, but it's not like cute. What about the green? We have a little color moment going on here. <sighs> Where's my normal shoes? Okay, wait, I just had a thought. What if I then did with the blue, the blue shoes kind of change a lot. Where's like my standard clothing at? Oh, here it is. With this, what if we did this? Black sandals. Maybe we just need like a bell. Like what if we do the white belt and like the green? See, if I had green shoes, this becomes really easy, but I just don't have green shoes. This is kind of cute with a black belt. It's giving like goth moment. And then we do the black sandals like you guys said. It's clipping. Well, just use your imagination. This is, this is cute. Like, I feel like someone from Aespa would wear this. This isn't cute, really. I feel like you guys aren't seeing the vision. Like, okay, hold on, I gotta change my hair up. I think the sexiest hair a girl can have is a bob, if we're being real. Like, a bob gives, like, so sexy and sultry. And it won't get in the way when you're trying to give head. The bob. I feel like men like pigtails as well. At least that's what Lana Del Rey likes to say. Like this is cute. And like we can do like this like black hair, like so goth moment. And like like this dark eye, like really creepy moment. Some like darker blush maybe. The paw prints are not gonna- maybe the heart freckles. Just like pull it all together. And then my heart clip. This kind of eating, I don't know. This kind of eating. This kind of eating though, I don't know. I feel like it just has to be the shorts though. Like the shorts kind of pull it together. Less than three. <laughs> Wait, what happened to my skirt? It's usually right here in this category. Did they take it away from me? Bro, they took my skirt. Oh no, there it is. <laughs> Dark blue jeans with a pink skirt. This is the worst thing about this game because I could sit here all day doing this. The cargo pants are so, the skirt is like, this is the best you guys. I don't know, like this is the best. Do we agree or we don't? Like this is the cutest, for real. We can even do the white, we can even do the white just with the red. That's kind of sickening, babe. <laughs> I know I'm spending a long time on this, but it's really important. Like, this is going to be going in a fashion magazine. 
dark wash jeans. I just don't see the vision. Like, this is a vision to me. This is like, it doesn't, it just doesn't hit the same. The hair brown, no, the hair needs to be black. That eats. So you guys want this. And it's giving you guys sexy. Try to become Japanese so Eugene will take you with them to Japan. <laughs> I'm gonna become transracial. The pigtails are so goth, though. Okay, what do you guys want? The Emily hair, really? We could just do this hair. This hair is always a moment. Like, it's very simple, but it's cute. The bob is giving, like, little, like, nya girl. Like, I don't, like, this is gonna be giving, like, nya. Yeah, no, that's not happening. We're not having that. We should steal Emily's hair. The, the pigtails were so much cuter. Like, no, this is not eat. I don't like this. The last hair Mary says, let's see. It might give, honestly. I do like that last hair. Oh yeah, this might be the one. That is cute. It shows with my tits. I just feel like this, okay, what about with this? Like, this just is so sickening now. Okay, if it wasn't clipping, you guys would be loving it. Cause you guys can't get past the clipping. But like, girl, this is a really cute look. <laughs> okay, guys, mods, I wanna pull. White skirt, put on it, white skirt. Cargo pants. Or dark jeans. Mods pull, mods work, mods do some work. Please mods, get to work. I can't tap out of my game. Dark jeans, skirt, or cargo pants. Vote. The cargo pants are kind of giving now. With the chunky belt, it's definitely a moment. Thank you so much Twink Tropical. Hope you're having a good night. It's so close. I can't click the poll. You guys have to tell me what wins. The jeans are winning by a landslide, really? I'm so gagged that you guys don't like this. Like, I think this is so cute. Like, just sit with it for a minute. 153 jeans, 24 The 24 bitches that pick skirt, you're my bitches. Because this is like everything. It's like really giving. Okay, we'll do the ugly jeans, whatever. This is not giving hot though. Like Eugene's gonna hate this look and break up with me, watch. Like, I feel like he hates all this clothes. The hair was cute. I'm happy with the hair. This is like my favorite hair in the game. The skirt is idiot with that outfit. No, it's, I kinda look cunt. Wait, I kinda look fucking cunt. <gasps> Bitch, I look fucking cunt though. Okay, Eugene, I'm ready. He's gonna break up with me because I look goth. He's gonna literally like want to put my head in the toilet and like flush it. Fucking pull my eye out and fucking chew on it and fucking shove it in his ass and then shoot it out like a ping pong ball. Can you shove your own eye in your ass and then give birth to it? That's kind of sexy. But you look kind of cunt though. Like girl, I'm kind of giving right now. I don't know. Emily's jealous. Emily's so fucking jealous of me, girl. Oh wait, I missed my door because I was thinking about Emily's jealousy and how she should hate herself. Bulimic bitch. Okay, hey girl. Let me just make some last minute changes before we start. To my outfit? <laughs> Roar about like to say. a lion. Oh. Here we go. Okay. Girl, I look fucking stupid. What the fuck? Excellent. That's a great shot. Girl, no Tokyo, it's not. Here I come. Hold great on, I gotta shot. move my cat. Here we go. She's on my computer. <laughs> <laughs> Girl. That one won't work. Maybe try to smile more. Okay. Chin up just a little. Okay, I got it. Nice. Okay, wait, I'm fucking eating now. I'm fucking eating now. I'm fucking eating, bitch. I'm fucking eating. Okay, why am I doing that? Girl, you gotta hold still for the picture at some point. Here we go. <laughs> okay, that, that was kind of sultry. Thanks for your help. I really appreciate it. Did I look good? Did it turn out well? Yeah, I guess they turned out okay. Don't worry about it. They'll be fine. I just need to get these uploaded so I can start working on them. Thanks again for your help. It's all good. 
Let me know when you're finished. I really <laughs> want to see them. <clears throat> because she was literally posing and doing this. this. This was literally her. She was like... Or like... Like, girl, what the fuck? Oh, now this golf guy's trying to fuck me. Okay, he still loves me a lot. Your like, hair looks good today. It's really Thanks. like I've been practicing all week. You've been practicing hair all week? That's weird. <sighs> okay, okay. So that went okay, I guess. He still loves me. He still loves me, so that's all that matters. We got done through our second date. I think the next step is he takes me to prom, right? Like, I don't know. Is it time for him to take me to prom? <laughs> Girl, my tits do look... Oh, this jealous fucking bitch. You're so fucking jealous. Oh my god. Yeah, he's over the little Heike Mori girls. He wants a goth girl now, bitch. Yeah, you're so fucking jealous. Bitch, look at your ugly fucking socks, bitch. What the fuck are you even wearing? That little polka dot twister shirt. What are you, nine? She's such a nasty fucking bitch. No, this look is eating, honestly. You guys kind of spill with this jeans. Oh my god, I can't afford a prom dress. You kind of spilled. What was my prom dress again that I wanted? I think it was pretty cheap, actually, the one that I wanted. Because I wore a $1,000 date in our first dress. Which just even makes it more sickening that he gave me $100 to go buy a whole outfit. Whenever I spent $1,000 on a dress to spend one night with him. What was it? The guy that works here is so... Hi. How are you today? Gay. Did I want this one? Or did I want this one? This no, I spent two thousand on this fucking dress. Two thousand dollars. The red one. I kind of want to try it on. No, I don't want to be spoiled. I want to be a surprise. This is not a prom dress. It's like a go-go dancer dress, bitch. This is like a beach dress. This one will look so. This dress is so pretty, and I could really dress it up with some really cute accessories, though. I should go buy new glasses for prom. Oh, this one is so pretty too. <gasps> but the blue one, you guys. The blue one might eat. He likes, oh, this one's cute. <gasps> okay, wait, wait. Should I do the blue? He doesn't like the red, so we're not doing the red. Should we, should we, should we do the white, the blue, or this red one? Which one should we do? Those are the ones that he likes, so we have to pick one of those. The dark red one, this one. This one is really cute, honestly. I also love the blue one. We don't have to pull right now because it's not prom yet, but, and we also have eight, like 50 bucks. So we need a, that one's 800. How much is this one? We need at least 500. I can make that in one day, babe. I'm gonna go do laundry. Please keep us in mind for dark your event. Dark red looks so hot. It is very themed and pretty. I feel like it'll be such a night to remember. Oh my god. I'm gonna get pregnant at fucking prom. All these fucking ugly bitches. I think I own every hairstyle in the game. So I think I'm good on that department. Did I miss the laundromat? I feel like I did. I wasn't paying attention. Pregnant at prom. That is so fierce. Like anyone who gets pregnant at prom is really sickening. Did you guys see that the next season of Yellow Jackets isn't coming out till 2025? I'm so annoyed about that. Hello, dear. What can I do for you today? Oh, Grandma, I would love to make some porridge with you, Grandma. I bet you this lady's a hoarder, and I bet she tweaks out in the middle of her fucking hoarding pile. Tweaking in the hoarding pile. Like, literally tweaking in a fucking hoarding pile. I'm here for the job. Oh, lovely. Okay, here we go. I got it's this. It's a basic rate for all items, <laughs> and I'll give you a bonus if you do it quickly. Happy yep. vagina lady. Okay, here we go. I've already mastered this job, but it pays really good, and it's really easy, so. Okay, so we have like a little blue. Okay, I got this. I got this. Don't worry. Girl, that matches. I don't know. Like, what? Oh, this is not going well already. Girl, what the fuck? This is going really bad. Okay, we got one. I always love to do people's Okay, mind. okay. It makes me so Okay. I don't know what goes with that. Like, I don't know what fucking goes with that, girl. Oh, fuck, I saw that. Okay, okay. Where did I see that? The hot pants. Like, oh my god, I'm flopping. No, that's there. I always love to that's do people's No, laundry. no. Oh, that, that, and that, that, it and that. Makes me so happy to see clean clothes. Okay. Got it. Killed it. 
Kill that. Kill that. Yeah, but not you, dear. You don't have. Is she gonna pay me five hundred dollars? Here's your wages. Please come and help me again, dear. That didn't give me five hundred. Are you fucking kidding me, bitch? Like, are you fucking serious right now? Bitch, I'm gonna text Emily. Like, I haven't seen her this whole time we've been playing. Like, she's such a fake fucking friend. She never even texts me. Like, Emily, hello? Like, girl, where are you? You wanna hang out? I'm bored, tell me something. Yeah, girl, tell me something, bitch. Like, text me, bitch. Like, hello? Now is it just me or did the days get fucking shorter? Like, hello? I did one job. Can it wait for tomorrow? Just going to bed. What the hell? You're such a fuck. I should dance maybe to make some, some money. Okay, I don't know. Like... Should I, should I, should I, should I, should I do some dancing? I'm a really good dancer. Let's do it. Okay. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Hey, 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 baby. Hey, hey, baby. Oh, yes. Hey, hey, baby, 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 baby. Okay. This one's pretty easy. I should be able to kill this. I should be able to kill this. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is a perfect run for sure. Perfect, 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 perfect. perfect. Okay, okay, okay. Kinda killing it, kinda killing it. Oh, eh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go. That, that was so fucking bullshit. That's because of my Elon Musk brain trip needs to be charged. Like, what the... What the fuck? Like, are you fucking serious? It's okay, it's okay. We won't miss another one. We got it, bitch. Why did my outfit change? Oh, oh no, I was looking at my own pussy. Like, what the fuck? Here we fuck about this part. This part is just fucking ridiculous, though, if you really think about it. Like, not even a fucking Albert Einstein could do this shit, for real. Wait, I'm kind of Albert Einsteining it up, though, bitch. Bitch, it's giving Albert Einstein. It's giving fucking Tom Hurst Jefferson. It's giving Mary Wilton Calkins. Like, I don't know. Like, it's kind of eating. It's kind of eating. Oh, period. Oh, period. How fucking long is this fucking song? Oh, my God. There's no way I miss too many. Okay, like, we got it, girl. Did I meet my goal yet? Oh my god, I'm not on my fucking goal. Oh no. Okay. I'm so close, though. Oh my god, please. Please, please, please. Did I get it? Okay, I got it. I got it. We're good. 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 We are good 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 we are good
Are you fucking kidding me? Girl, that's literally fucking ridiculous, babe. <laughs> like, how the fuck, how the fuck did I not get paid for that? No, I can't afford to change my room because I have to buy my prom dress. I don't know what day prom is. I don't, when, what day is prom in this game? Does anybody know? Like, I finished all my dates. I feel like it's going to come up. I'm wearing stuff again. It's really cute. Like, I don't know. Is prom coming up? Like, I'm scared. I don't have my dress yet. Probably Saturday. Saturday, Sunday. Saturday. It better not be tonight, bitch. He hasn't even asked me yet. Two weeks after you get the prom proposal? Oh my god, that's so long, bitch. Holy shit, that's like forever, forever, girl. Like, what the fuck? I have, I'm not booked for shit. Wait, I got a text from Eugene. Oh my god, I'm screaming. Hi, you, me, Park. I'll be in 104 if you're interested. <gasps> he wants to go cruising with me? Oh my god, we're gonna go cruising. I'm coming, Eugene. Is he gonna hate my outfit because I'm goth? Will he not prom pose to me? Oh my god, Lucy's gonna be so fucking jealous. Yeah, you bitch. You fucking bitch. I'm fucking your best friend, bitch. He loves me more, bitch. Remember my pussy wetter than a puddle, bitch. It's giving Judy hops. Hey. Remember that date you were talking about? Of course. I thought you just forgot. You wanna go? Let's go. Like. No way. Let's go right I'm now. Always down to hang out with you. Oh, really? That's uh, wow. That's great. So let's fucking go. Look, look at the fucking show on the road, bitch. It's on Friday. Are you fucking kidding me? It's on fucking Friday. It's on fucking Friday. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Why can't we go right now? <sighs> That's fine. That's fine. We'll play till at least Friday. You know what? I have to. I have some work to do anyway. I need to save up money. Like. We have some things we need to get done anyway. I need to master the skating job, but I feel like it's just not possible for me. Like, is this the prom? Is there, a, there's no job at the promenade. We should do mini golfing. Let's do mini golfing. There is mini golfing too. Let's do that. The skate, the, the fucking rollerblading one is just too much. Like, it's just too much. Let's play crazy golf, period. You wanna play a little Bob girl? Okay, here we go. Bitch, I'm about to serve. Okay. Hate that. That's a hole in one. That's an eagle. That's a bird of prey. That's a Harley Quinn moment. Yeah, hole in one, baby. Hole in one. Are you fucking. Are you fucking kidding? Um. Are you fuck. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Don't fucking play with me like that. I can't see my fucking mouse on this fucking game. Okay, 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 come on, come on, go in. Please, please. Roll up, yeah, 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 okay. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Girl, where am I shooting this fucking ball? Spin around, bitch, I'll loopsie. Okay, ate that, ate that, perfect. Birdie, is giving birdie. What the fuck is this? What the, f okay. Oh, this is like, you have the fucking, like, architect to play this fucking mini golf shit. Like, what the fuck is this? Okay. Girl. Oh my fucking. <sighs> Get it together. Get it together. I can't see my fucking mouse when I'm playing the fucking game. Like, holy shit. <laughs> Kind of ate that. Are you fucking kidding me right now, girl? Maybe more, a little bit more to the side. Girl, what the fuck? That's even worse. Mama, how am I gonna? 
Am I going too fast? Like, how could I possibly be doing it too fast? More power? I maxed out, girl. And now I'm out of bounds. Go more to the left. Which left? Go to the left more. Which left? I don't know my lefts and rights, girl. I don't know my lefts and rights. Too closer to the water or closer to the corner? The water or the corner? Okay, thank you for the arrows. So like to here? Mama, that was literally so fucking bad. Like, why would you even make me fucking do that? Like, you need to start it more from the left, not shoot it to the left. Oh, you mean like adjust my ball a little? Wait, wait, what if I like ricochet it off this? Hit it closer, mama. You spell, you spell. Okay. Don't roll back here. Don't roll back here. Are you fucking kidding me? Wait, fuck the ramp. Let's just go right for the hole. <laughs> no, like literally that fucking ain't girl. <laughs> no, that fucking ain't. Okay. What is this, a nebula? Here we go. Okay. Okay, that's really annoying, but fine. Okay, let's hit it like, let's let's kind of like a little rico ricochet moment here. Ricochet, 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 ricochet. And then just like very lightly put it in there. That was a great, uh-huh. I kind of killed that. Albatross. Albatross. Period. There's no way I didn't win that, right? Okay, there, I got it. What the fuck is that? Like a new skirt? What is that? Okay, I have $600. How much was my dress? Fack win? You cannot be on top of my computer, girl. Come here, come here. Come here. You're a beautiful princess. Why don't you look out the beautiful window? There you go. She loves looking out windows. She's a little kitten, of course. It was 5.50, oh my fucking god. We have to do more golf. We have to do more fucking golf. It never fucking ends, bitch. Let me fucking golf again, bitch. <sighs> okay, it's fine. I'm really good at golfing, it's fine. Like, I cannot wear this sweater anymore. I'm just like sweating. Like all this, this is just like all becoming too much. This is just all becoming too much. It's all becoming too much for me. Okay. Okay, mini golf. Here we go. Level hard. Welcome to the wind tunnel. What the fuck does? Are you fucking kidding me? This is why our plan. This is some Taylor Swift ass golf course, with like using all this electricity. Okay. Just, just do it, babe. Okay, yeah. Bitch, that would have been. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. That was still really good. That was so, bitch, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Jesus, fuck. <sighs> okay, it's fine. I don't, like, I fucking hate this. Like, this is just so fucking ugly and stupid farting. Period. That was a very twee hit. Yeah, you better, condor, condor. I was giving condor. Girl, what the fuck is this? Okay, we're gonna have to do a little ri ricochet. A little ricochet moment. Ricochet, ricochet. Are you fucking kidding me, girl? Girl, you are such an untalent. Are you fucking kidding me, girl? Girl, are you fucking kidding me with that? Okay, okay. <gasps> Mama, what the fuck is wrong with you at this point? Ooh, perfect, perfect! Okay, I guess that's fine. This angle's really bad for me though. Jesus! <laughs> I 
That's fine. That's fine. Okay, here we go. That should be perfect. <laughs> that should be perfect. That should be perfect. That should be perfect. That should be perfect. Ooh. Ooh, yes. Okay, I'll take that. I'll take that. Perfect. Oh my God, if there was a small child in front of me, I'd bite all its fingers off while it's awake. Okay, whatever, whatever. We have six shots to get this last one. Where's the hole? This looks so easy. No, I'm gonna, this looks literally so fucking easy. Are you serious? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking lost your fucking mind? Where the fuck did the hole go? Wait, what? Where? What country is this? Girl, I'm so confused. Are you dumb? What do you, what? What do you mean? Like, I really don't get it. I genuinely don't get it. I feel like I'm trying to cure cancer right now out of my garage. Like, I don't understand this. No, I, I, I really, okay. Jesus fucking Christ. Why are there daisies on it? Because it's fucking girly. What the fuck am I doing? I'm my dog. 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 <sighs> okay. We got it. We got it. That's fine. That's fine. That's actually fine. That's actually fine. There we go. Period. We got it. 17 out of 18. We're good. We have one shot at this. We literally have one shot at this. If I get it into that little clavicle, you see that clavicle right there? It'll come out of that clavicle and roll right in. Do you see that? That's all it takes. Don't? What do you mean don't? What do you mean don't? It won't? What do you mean it won't? What do you mean by that? Surely that, like, will teleport it to there. Oh my god. It will go back to the other way. Okay, I'm gonna try and, but like, okay, I'm gonna have to ricochet it. Okay, new plan. We have to hit the very side of that, the very corner, and bounce it up. We have to bounce it from there up to the ball. Not into the tunnel, but to the very thin side of it. We have one shot at this. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Messed up. It's going really badly. I missed. It's horrible. I fail. Just fucking kill me right now. Oh my god! Keep it quiet, keep it cute. A boogie? Like a booger in my big fucking nose? What do you fucking want? I'm not trying again. Like, I'm not trying again. Wish I was pregnant so bad. Me too. I need some seed really badly. Like, it's not a joke, you guys. Like, I desperately need seed. <laughs> <laughs> oh.
Okay, that, that was a little disgusting. I, it felt wrong even coming in like that. <laughs> that was not appropriate. That was not appropriate. That was not appropriate. I'm so sorry. I'm going to buy a hot dog at the beach. <laughs> Should we get our fortune told? Like, we just have to kill two days and then I have a date. The, the love of oneself is the beginning of a lifelong romance. What? Fate and love favor the bold. What? Thou livest but once to be afraid to live. What? And thou and then chances, and they will be taken. What? What love can do, the dares love attempt. What? Many a man who was won by a handsome smile to the woman most disarming gift. What? Anyways, I'm buying a hot dog. Yeah, I need a hot dog right now. Oh, yeah. She loves it. It's so delicious for her. She just loves that little hot dog there. Let's just hang out for a minute. Hey baby, you wanna fart when your pixie sticks empty? What do you want, girl? Shut up, excuse me. I used to love pixie sticks, but then I got scared of them because kids at elementary school would snort them. Like they would literally crush them up or crush up sweet tarts and snort them. Like those were literally the weirdest fucking boys in the whole fucking world. That was the weirdest ever. I wonder what happened to those boys. Their dicks probably fell off and they probably got brain cancer. I really don't know. Like, there's no way that's healthy. Yeah, people would try and smoke Smarties. Like, that shit was so fucking... Oh my god, Smarties were so young. Okay, like, I'm just waiting for bedtime at this point because my day is in two days. Like, what are we even going to do tomorrow? There's a magnet? Where's a magnet? Magnet? I love magnets. Where's a Magnet? Magnet? Move. It's a fucking magnet, bitch. Magnet? Ma magnet? There's no fucking magnet. Would you tell a heroin addict there's heroin right next to them? There's no fucking magnet. You fucking lied. Like, honestly, we're going home to go to bed. Like, I don't know. Home. Home. Let's just go to bed. Just go to bed. It's bedtime. No, I love magnets. Like, I love magnets so much. I'm a magnet kind of girl. Okay, we have one more day and then it's our date, you guys. Oh my god, I forgot the worst part of this game is just trying to kill time so the boys will actually give you attention. Which takes a long time. And apparently when he asked me to prom, we're gonna have to wait two whole fucking weeks. Like, oh my god, girl. Let me at least get into a cute little outfit for my date today. Like, I want to wear this, honestly. Like, this is cute with the green top. And my chunky brown belt. And my little sneaker. And this is my little boots. Like, this is kind of giving. Bitch, this is cute. This is really cute. Do you guys want to watch some of that gay dating show after we finish this date? Or no? The date, I mean, the belt is what makes it so, like, Y2K cutesy. Like, please. Please. That's what makes it, like, serve. Can I just go to bed right away? Like, I already have enough money for my dress. I don't need to be fucking with it. Can I just go literally right to bed? Like, I should really just go right to bed. I want to go to my fucking date. Like, I have a date that I need to get to. I can't. It's too early. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay, let's hang out with Emily. Let's just hang out with Emily. Where's Emily? Like, where's Emily? Emily, let's hang out. Like, honestly, where are you, Emily? I wanna see two men kiss. Oh my God, me too. I love seeing two men kiss, even though it's a sin and it's absolutely disgusting. I'm getting the latest gossip in the school. Bitch, you are such a fucking loser. Like, oh my god. I do not want to go back to school, honey. Like, I'd rather just go to the mall. Okay, I can afford my dress, so I don't know what else I would need money for at this point. No, she needs to get a fucking job. She's a fucking loser. Can someone give me some gossip? Like, I've gotten no gossip this whole playthrough. Like, hello? Any of you girls have any fucking gossip? Like, what are you girls even talking about? There's the school shooter. 
if you guys don't have fucking gossip. Like, none of these girls have fucking gossip. Who's this? Olivia. Does she have gossip? Like, hello, Olivia. Can you please gossip with me? Girl. Olivia. Olivia, will you gossip? You fucking bitch. Oh, there's the hottest guy in the game right there. <sighs> Fuck it. Let's get our hair done. Like, fuck it, let's just get our hair done. Welcome. How can we, have, I help? we have nothing better to do but to get our fucking hair done. I'll have a makeover, Like, please. I don't know. Certainly. If you could come over here, please. Okay, new hair. Like, we need a new... These are our only two options left. This one, you know, this one's not bad, honestly. This one's really not bad. We should do this. Our dress is gonna be red, so maybe we should go ginger. He doesn't like ginger. The blonde. I feel like Ginger would be so cute with our dress, though. Get the box braids. You always put on some bullshit. Mousy brown. Like, poopy brown. I got a fart in me. Deep within my cavity. I don't know. Like, the purple might be cute as well. Poopy butthole brown. This is like a bit auburn. This is like Auburn. Mm. This is what he likes. Like, let's just do this. Cause he fucking likes it. What a piece of shit. He doesn't like that. He doesn't like that. The pink could be cute. What does he even like? Like, oh my God, he's such a fucking hater. That kind of matches my hair. The purple is kind of cute, honestly. But that matches my hair. So let's do that. Let's get a new lipstick. Like, that would be so cute, but he doesn't even fucking like it. Wait, we should go like Victorian. Like, this could be really cute. Hold on. If we go like full Victorian moment. Like, this will look so good with the dress. Are you guys seeing it? Excuse me? Like the, 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 the red dress. I think it will eat. Pink butterfly wings. Are those butterfly wings? Not the dollar signs. The blush options in this game are just like horrendous though. So that that kind of works. In my school somebody was throwing bloody tampons on the ceiling and they would stick and someone would have to come and scrape them off. Oh, that's cute. Hold on you guys, I gotta let my cat in the bedroom. Okay, I'm back. All right. Let's do this. Is this cute or no? The black lippy is uggo. You think it won't? Okay, but I'm not saying with this look. I'm saying with my prom dress. That like deep maroon, dark prom dress. Like, it might look cute with that. No. It's ugly in general. Okay, well you guys are fucking haters. So what should we do, like pink? Like pink isn't gonna match. Maybe this red, but he hates it. He hates this red. We could do this one. It's kinda like orange, but at least he doesn't hate it. That will look bad. Oh my God, fuck him. I wanna fuck him. That's why I have to dress the way he wants me to and act the way he wants me to. Like, you guys don't understand what it takes to get a man. This is like not the prom hair color that I want though. Like I want to go ginger for it. Or green. I think green could also be very like cute or purple. Like, oh my God. No, like I hate this blush. Like Maybe just the female symbols or the blue. The blue could be like a juxtaposition. Tacky blush. Okay, bitch. He, he, he likes this rainbow. He likes this rainbow here. Female symbols, cause she's les. We could do the female symbols. He doesn't mind them and they're kind of not that noticeable. Should we do this hair instead? Does this suit my dress better? <laughs> 
I can't wear no blush right now because like, I, I have my heart freckles on. Okay, and then let's get new nails. We need like these nails. These will match my dress. Yeah, okay, perfect. Okay, we're good, let's go. Thank you for coming. There goes I all my fucking money. Look. There goes all my fucking money and I look even worse than when I fucking walked in there. I look fucking ugly and stupid. I look literally so ugly. I just spent all my fucking money and I look worse. I look kinda cute though. This is kinda cute though. This is kinda cute though. Jeans, Jeannie Marie. <gasps> Not Jeannie Marie, I'm screaming. Oh my God, I'm screaming, little Jeannie Marie. Stands out. Little Stain Marie. Oh, what a beautiful name for a little baby girl. Little Jean Stainy Marie. Oh my I'm God, here for the job. I'm screaming. Oh, lovely. It's a basic rate. Thank for you, all little Jean Stainy Marie. Little basic rate Marie. Quickly. <laughs> yep. Not little basic rate Marie. I'm screaming. Okay, here we go. I'm working. Leave me the fuck alone. This game is really fucking intense. Like, even the most biggest of tryhards can't pull this off like I can. I'm Queenie. The way I've gotten no matches yet, this is gonna be a really hard round, girl. I always love to do people's laundry. This is gonna be a really hard I'm round, so girl. Happy to see clean girl. Okay, there's that. That was like over here somewhere. Okay. I have no fucking clue where that is. It makes me so happy to see Girl, this is like ridiculous. Girl. Like, this round is, like, unheard of yeah, in this economy. I love to see all the clothes come out nice and clean. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Thank you for the help, dear. Yeah, you're going to be dead soon, old lady. Please come and help me again. She's going to get a prawn in her fucking brain. Okay, I'm going to bed. I have a day tomorrow. That's all I give a flying fuck about. <laughs> I love God and humble. Yeah, Jesus gave me everything I have. Depression, anxiety, eating disorder, welfare check. Like, fuck you, Jesus. You haven't given me shit that I actually want. Thank you so much, Zoloft. I really appreciate that. Okay, today's the big day, you guys. We have a date. Thank you so much. We're going to have to look our absolute best here. We need to look cute here, okay? This is a date. Right off the bat, we're changing the hairpin because it's really fucking ugly. Let's put on our little earrings because they're cute and no hairpin. Okay, for the date. For the date we're gonna wear, I already know what we're gonna wear, so don't worry. We're gonna wear this top, this little pink top, because it's very girly. And we're gonna pair it with this skirt, the skirt that I love. We'll take the belt off. You guys said I could wear this skirt, so I'm wearing it. And this has like, this like dark red trim on it. You see that? We can pair it with one of these shoes. I think these are cuter. Thoughts on the look? Thoughts on the look? This is a cute look to me. This is a cute look to me. Like I'm giving, bitch. I look a little pregnant, but maybe I am. This is what we're gonna wear to our date. I think he'll really like it. Because he likes quirky girls that are like clowns. That's why he likes Lucy, the little clown bitch, the little clown pussy. Like, oh my fucking God, I am so sick. Of I, I honestly have really negative feelings towards him since he gave me $100 to buy a whole outfit. Who the fuck is buying an outfit for $100? Unless I'm literally setting up children in factories, like fucking Rihanna. Bitch, I look sickening. Are you kidding me? Okay, oh my God, my date, my date. I have a date, I have a date right now. Oh my God, I literally have a date. When's my date? When, when is my fucking date? At 19, meet Eugenie in the park. Oh my God, okay. Okay, we're gonna wait outside the park for him. Oh my God, we're just gonna go wait for him. Like, honestly, where's the park? The park is down here, I think. And now we wait four hours for our date. So how are you guys? How's everyone doing? Everyone having a nice night? I can't tab out of the game. Like, I can't tab out of the game. It will literally break my whole fucking computer. Do you think he's gonna put out? I don't think so. He's very nerdy. He's very nerdy. 
I got my big ass Chipotle burrito. That's cute. What have you guys ate? I, today I had um, some mac and cheese and some jalapenos. Can you do the uh, name a hundred women challenge? No, I saw that on Twitter and I will not even try to do that because I already feel like a lot of people get angry with me about hating women. I will not try attempt that. I could 100% do it, but I'll do it in my spare time. Apple today, yes. That's not the park. Yeah, I'm waiting outside the park here. I like women. Can you do the Azalea Banks birthday game? I don't know. I'm not. I'm. I'm. I'm not quite sure of that. Bro, you live when I. You're live when I have to go to work tomorrow. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to. Name a hundred gays. I don't think any of them live. <laughs> lagging so bad what the hell what the hell just happened to me i'm lagging oh my god that was really bad you guys i just started lagging out. i'm so sorry mm. live finally i know sorry i was having so much computer troubles today i told you guys <laughs> it's almost time for our date you guys it's at 17 o'clock it's about to be 17 o'clock, you guys. Oh my god. Okay, it's 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 17 o'clock. It's time for our date. Oh my god, you guys are gonna be so romantic. Where is he? Where's my date? Where is he? Hello? Like is he here? I've been waiting all fucking week for this. Oh my god, at 19 o'clock? Are you fucking kidding me right now, bitch? Oh my god, girl. I'm just gonna stand here in the park like a fucking freak. I wanna have fuck with a statue, bitch. <laughs> this game is making me like lose my fucking brain. Thank you so much, Amani. I really appreciate you. Watch shorts while you wait. No, because I can't tap out of the One game. One you is you're going viral, Queenie. Uh, no, I'm not. It's a bug. <laughs> Did they say something about an STD? No, I think everybody with STDs is very brave. I, I don't speak down on other people. I'm a very positive, humble light to the community. The LGBTQ community means a lot to me. And I would never put them down. I would never put them down. Thank you. 1K to 489. You know, I, want, I wonder when you guys are gonna learn the glitch that when you end stream and go back live, it doubles your viewers. <laughs> I am very so kind and nice, and we have a date in 30 minutes here. This is kind of like my date with, this is kind of like my date with you guys while we wait. My date with you guys. This has been really romantic, you guys. I just want to say I really appreciate you guys, and I hope you will consider giving me a little kiss. I love you, baby. We fart, and the girls transcend live in the fartening in the kingdom of Down syndrome. And I have a date. Okay, period. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Okay. So where is he? Where, where, oh, is he here? Why is he in the maze? Let's get him in the fucking maze too. Okay, I'm coming. Wait, he's, no, he's right there. Eugene. I, a blind person, I'm not going to risk blinding you with my fanny part. I'm oh really God. glad you changed your mind. I can be pretty Bitch, stupid the way about I was waiting sometimes. on my burrito to I come. It came what the fuck happened between us? Look at my it? ass in this oh, skirt. I said, oh, Norbo, bro, I need Look. my food while I watch one of my um, fave gays. What? Good. A lil chomp and watch nice. ya feel me? Yes. I'm fucking <laughs> this nice. up. Who Let's else go noshing? Sit for a minute. Wait, why did he apologize? Thank you so much, Grocery. Why did he apologize to me? What? Nothing happened. And also, my ass is so fucking fat, bitch. You know that shit farts. I know I keep saying it lately. But I mean it. You're really pretty. Who the fuck is this bitch? I know you get nervous. She's like spying and laughing on my Guys date. Like you don't usually like girls like me, and sometimes I really don't know what to say. Like just now when you called yourself a girl and me a guy? Did I? Uh huh. See what you do to me? It's crazy. You're cute. But that's probably why you got into oh fashion photography in the first place, right? He's All those tea? Pretty girls. Taking pictures of pretty girls doesn't hurt. But that's not the reason. Oh my no. god. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
It's like I could just understand him because we're just like so close and in love. Like he doesn't even need to say anything. I just know what he means. You're not interested in shooting sporting events? You get to go to free games and get paid for it. And be around all those crazy fans? No thank you. I like not getting pushed around if a certain team is losing. Well then how'd you get into fashion? Lucy and I like old school movies, so we tried taking- Oh, don't bring up your ex-girlfriend on our fucking date, you fucking piece of shit. They turned out to be shit. the Because I swear to so fucking I god, I will leave right nice. now. I will fucking like leave right now. Sometime. Even if they are- You have fucking pictures of Lucy of course, in your house? I just have to find them. And that reminds me. I'm a little worried about her. Why? Is she, like, standing right behind me? No, you're okay. I would have warned you if she was. Really? Surprised with how she reacted. Really? Support Lucy, just Lucy. I have to support her, don't I? I have to fucking support her, don't I? I fucking hate Lucy. She's a little hikiki mori femme cell neat pilled bitch. Like I fucking hate her. Like I'm a corporate ri I'm literally a corporate widget. Just that bitch. Where my bops at? She's so hiking Kimori. Take a few vape and don't inhale. Are you addicted? No shade. I don't inhale it. It's just for the vibes. See, I'm healthy. You're the other woman I fear. I'll support her. What's there to be surprised about? She's a girl who feels like she's losing her best friend. <sighs> Not only to a foreign country, but to another girl. Yeah, and I feel like such Why a Why is he going to Japan in that sooner? Don't worry, Eugene. Boys hardly ever know what girls are trying to say. He has like rigor mortis in his hands. You see that? I think you should find some time to spend with her though. Chronic fatigue syndrome like Marina. Something. Like yeah. what the fuck is going on here? And I do have one other thing I want to do for her before I leave. <laughs> What's that? Get her a ticket to he a doctor. She wants to Phil eat show? Japanese pussy? Sorry, that one slipped out. Sure it did. No, I was thinking about hooking her up with Petey. What? What if she doesn't like him? Believe me, she does. That's all she ever talks about. Petey this, Petey that. Did you see Petey? Can she there? ride? Oh, I think Petey smiled at me today. So you're gonna play matchmaker? Nope. You are. Me? How are you? Please me don't make I don't give a fuck it's about easy. Lucy. I had to beg her to go to the movies with Are you movies, fucking kidding me? All you have to do is drop a letter in our locker <laughs> while we're out. What's it say? Why can't you, you know, do it, it bitch? Some things from Petey's point of view. I wrote something about your hair is the color of my favorite sunset or something cheesy like that. Oh, Petey oh, likes Petey music. He's simply a fucking sure DJ. Could you imagine if she found out about this? We thought she was mad before. Do you He's think it's a second degree high yeah, from that work. vape you're smoking I'm on? Brilliant, Got remember? his ass speechless. Yeah. He can't but get his thoughts together. Thank goodness, cause he can't focus on that atrocious hair. outfit she's I'll gauging take my in. Chances. It's for a good cause. Without me, she'll be pretty lonely, and that would ruin my trip to Japan just thinking of it. He's so selfish. Slip it in the locker between. He doesn't care that she would be lonely. He cares because it will make him upset. What a great fucking date, Eugene. Like, all we did is fu You're not gonna kiss me? All we did was fucking talk about Lucy. That's literally all we fucking did. Didn't even ask how my day was, about my new hair. I just got new makeup. Like, are you fucking kidding me, bitch? That was a fucking nightmare. That was a fucking nightmare. Who just fucking texted me? Like, girl. Plant the love letter between Lucy's locker in the sports hall between three and six. Well, that's already passed. You have to meet the task tomorrow or else the game will glitch and you can never do it. Jesus, fuck. Okay, I'm going home and going to bed. And then we're getting off this game. Like, I am, I'm high school dreamed out for the night. Like, this has just been horrible, honestly. This has been horrible. My date was horrible. I failed my roller skating job. I failed my mini golfing job. I fucked up my room decorating. Like, I'm so fucking over this girl. I didn't get seated. <sighs> like, this is disgusting. This is really disgusting. Yeah. Not the eight minute VOD. And it'll be posted, don't you worry, babe. Okay. Okay. Let's watch show. Let's watch show.
Let's watch show, you guys. It's time for show. It's time for quiet time and show because my apartment has actually entered quiet time now. Below deck. Are we going to start below deck or are we going to watch gay? What's the vibe? Like, are we going to watch gay or are we going to watch below deck? Can we watch the Mama Mama June show? I've already seen it, though. I've been watching it in my own time. To a poll, the British Naked Dating Show. We can watch that in Discord. That show is so weird, though. It's just, like, dicks everywhere. Below Jack is so boring. To be honest, I'm watching the episode of it. It's like, oh, America Next Top Model. America's Next Top Model. Gay show is ill. Below Deck or gay? Vote on the poll, bitch. Vote on the fucking poll. I couldn't understand the show. They talk too fast. The gays, yeah, because gays get very excited about men because they have nothing else. Gays have really low self-esteem. <sighs> Can we watch Spongebob? No. What's the, okay, the gay show is, pr it's pretty much Love Island, but it's gay people. And they pair together gays. No, the gay show is not Dilf Manor. What is the gay show called? It's like, it's like, I don't, I don't know what Dilf Manor is. It's like, I, 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 I kissed a boy. It's called I kissed a boy. Bad Girls Club, I kissed a boy. Okay, I guess we're watching I kissed a boy. I'm not going to restart my VOD because I literally just fucking restarted it. So we can just get into this gig. I kissed a boy. Here it is. We are not watching Naked Attraction. Okay, we're up to episode two. If you missed episode one, you didn't miss anything. There's just like some gays that had their asses out. They were kissing. They brought in a new guy. Now the twink is like upset. And there's some guy in there who's like a virgin. And he's like kind of creepy. Like, you didn't miss shit, bitch. You didn't fucking miss shit. Okay. It feels like the first time. Okay, here we go. Let's get into this gag. All right. Let me try and set this up so that it maybe is a little bit better. I kissed a boy. Perfect. Okay, warning. This might, if you're like 12, this might show like man ass. Just briefly. But it, it might show just man ass. Is this episode two or is this still episode one? This is episode one. We need to go to episode two. Okay, here we go. Well, we're done with this show. Okay, what are we watching? Like, it's getting late. So what are we watching? Blow deck? America's Next Top Models, Models Cycle 4. Traders Canada. Porters, Rock of Love, Pussy Clip Barbie, Below Deck. I'm down for Below Deck, girl. But the question is, Below Deck is a flop show, so can I find it online? Daisy of Love is better. I've never seen Daisy of Love, but I do want to watch that. What you want, use SD for you. Rock of Love, Hoarders, Below Decks. Okay, yeah, vote on this poll, babe. So that'll be, that's good. I do want to watch Daisy of Love at some point. Okay, whatever show we watch, the show after this, we're watching Rock of Love so that we can watch Daisy of Love. Because I've never seen Daisy of Love and I actually really want to see it. America's Next Top Model. We're going to watch Cycle 4. If we watch it, because that, that's the one Sasset and Sal see them like all. Yeah, Daisy is so cunty. I loved Rock of Love when I was a kid. It was such a good show. We've been wanting Below Deck. Well, the, I fear the girl leads don't want it. Like, I just fear. Me and Daisy are besties on IG. You're such a fucking liar. Does she have an IG? She was my fave as a kid when I watched this. She's on private. This is not her girl. Like, Daisy was so sickening. Like, that was mother. She was so mother. Like, are you kidding? She was literally so mother. Like, she was queenie. She was so queenie. We loved her back in the day. 
Okay, let me see what I can find. Hey, babe, I'm gonna put a show on if you wanna come out here. Okay. Okay, little boy. Okay, so what are we watching? America's Next Top Model. You guys, we like America's Next Top Model. Stop complaining. America's Next Top Model. Season four. There is like so many seasons of this fucking show. It's a good, is that a good season? We do like it. I started Breaking Bad, but I couldn't finish it. That shit was too boring, girl. It was like good for the first season and then it just gets so boring. Season four. Let me see if I can find it. Okay, let me see. Let me see. I don't know where, to, where I can find, find this show. Like, oh, mm. let me see here. Like I'm doing some investigating. Matt snapped. What the fuck did Matt say now? Are you fucking kidding me? We want Below Deck. Oh my god. Like we'll, we'll, we will watch Below Deck eventually, you guys. It's coming. Like it's coming. You guys, we have, we, we have to watch Below Deck. I can't find this anywhere. Like it's only, I don't have Hulu and I'm not setting up for Hulu. Like I'm sorry, we, we just can't. Like I just, I can't find this anywhere. Like, I don't know. Like, I, I just don't know. <laughs> no, I don't like Hulu. They take your data. I got a site. No, you fucking don't, Mama Girl. You're such a liar. Wait, I might have found it. But this is episode 10. <laughs> This is like, okay. I think I found it, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm scared. Is this it? <laughs> is this even it? Remember when Zoho posted gay porn? Yeah, but it was in a feminist way. It's like not working though. Like, hello? Like, what's going on with this? Oh my God, you guys, it's like this thing. It's like gonna be sped up and like, you guys, I don't know about this. It's like sped up and flipped. Like, it's Noelle, and I'm way excited. <laughs> I'm ready to compete against the most gorgeous girl I've probably ever seen in my life. I can flip it, okay? I can flip it. Hold on. But I can't make it go slower. Okay, then I, I have to watch it in my, like, stream thing. I cannot watch it on the actual website. Okay. How am I gonna slow it down, girl? Like, with what settings? Can I pitch it down? It's not pitched up, it's just oh. fat. First time I came here and I got in a fight. That fake ho on the pier on my feet. I came back, I'm not gonna say a different person, but in a lot of ways, I'm a better person. I know I have to do good this time. Okay. Okay. Just tell y'all right now. Here we go. You know what you're so for pretty. I need some plus nail and kick one. <laughs> I auditioned for the last competition, and I didn't make it <laughs> to Cara. It ripped my heart out. I tried out again. This is insane. Please find a different one. Okay, get this illegal website out of here. After I grab it, of course. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs>
Girl, they're not gonna have it on here. Like I already know it. America's next top model. Okay. Oh my god, they have it. Oh my god, you couldn't mother that bitch ugly. Okay, hold on. Let me. Okay. My mama thinks I was born to be a top model. I'm excited. We haven't watched one of these in a long time. My name's Noel, and I'm way excited. <laughs> I'm ready to compete against the most gorgeous girls I've probably ever seen in my life. Do any of them I'm stay Kaylee, famous after winning? LA. Yeah. It's a little weird. I've never been here before. Cara Delevingne won the show. Crazy. Winnie Harlow. My name is Haley Bieber. I'm from Tallahassee, Florida. This is what I want to do since day one of my life. Whatever it takes to win, baby, I'm in. I'm Brandy. This is my first time riding a plane. This is just like totally tripping me out. I'm Yubi. I was born in Mexico. Now I'm just a California girl. Just act like it's not happening. <laughs> my name is <laughs> Tiffany. I'm from Miami, Florida, and I am so excited to be here for a second chance. Oh, first time I came here and I got in a fight. <laughs> okay, here's what I'm going to say. We're going to watch this. Then we're going to watch Rock of Love. Then we're going to watch Below Deck. And then we're going to watch Daisy of Love. And that's it. say a different person but in a lot of ways I'm a better person I know I have to do good this time <laughs> you guys give me no credit when I'm on schedule we finish a show in a week I'm only five days I will just tell you all right now <laughs> Well, you know what? You don't so have to worry about me because I'm plus nail and pick one. <laughs> I auditioned for the last competition. I'm gonna get yeah, on schedule. I, I sound like Amberlynn Reed saying she's gonna get on track. <laughs> it ripped my heart out. I'm hungry. I tried out again. This is my second chance. And I am not wasting anything with this one. The first time I saw everyone all together was when we all met in a big room. Everyone's gonna check each other out and try to figure out. Who's their competition? Hello. So welcome to LA and welcome to the Western Century Plaza Hotel. Take a look around this room. Someone here is America's next top. You guys better get your game on and bring it, okay? Get a space in this house. So what do you think Tyra's looking for? I think she's looking back, for somebody guys. really unique. Somebody that's real. Somebody that can bring something new. I think she's looking for me. All right. I know what I'm looking for. I'm assuming they have it tomorrow at 1 p.m. I saw every single girl's tape in here. I remember there's a girl in here who feels like she once was a cat and is now reincarnated as a woman. <laughs> Did Tyra ever expose for doing coke? Or is she just quirky? I'm Some girls are just quirky. Zazz. I'm looking for girls that are beautiful on the outside, but duh, most models are beautiful on the outside, but I'm looking for the beauty on the inside. Something that is rare, something that is extra special. Just be on, but be yourselves. Don't fake it. I can see through the fake, okay? So just be she real. Can. She really cared. She came. It totally pumped us up for the week. With so many girls to choose from, I'm relying on the help of my very opinionated colleagues. Mr. J. Manuel, the creative director of all of our photo shoots. I love Is he canceled? Because he's kind of cute. A little hoochie. And Miss J. Alexander. Our runway coach and diva extraordinaire. It's about to fall, but you're not letting it happen. It's not going to fall. Uh oh. Come on in, Rebecca. My name is Rebecca. I'm 21, and I'm from Minneapolis, Minnesota. I love this girl so much. I'm actually on my way to being married and having the kids, but before I do that, 
I want to have fun. You have a very all-American and slightly California look. How do you see yourself being able to transform? Sweet Innocence is kind of my cover-up. I can kind of do some things and still get away with it. I lied and cheated and, you know, got in my way. Extremely but controversial challenges this season. Oh, God. A good, sweet, innocent person because it's always worked in my favor. I'll keep an eye out. So, like, I was very impressed with her. Like, she's a very sweet girl, but she's got some grit. Hi, everybody. Hi. My name is Kenya. I am studying biology at the University of California, Riverside. Okay, well, this okay. is my street. I live with my family during the summertime in Compton. The media represents Compton to be this place where you walk outside, you get shot. So if somebody were to see me anywhere and say, oh, she's from Compton. Oh, I didn't know that this can come from Compton. I'm oh, from okay. Italy. Look, you represent you. Right. You can inspire people mm -hmm. and say that you came from there, but you represent who you are. So right. remember that. If it came between modeling and being a doctor, I would absolutely Great tip. choose modeling. The way you can represent yourself without saying a word, I think that is so excellent. Hey y'all, I'm Kaylin. I'm from Broken Arrow, Oklahoma. <laughs> You've never seen America's Next Top Model. No, I don't watch a lot of TV. We only have like three channels and I work 50 hours a week. I don't know much about the fashion and how to walk or how to pose for pictures. I wasn't sure if I could Why actually the fuck do are it you here? toward us and back. Me going to Aldi. <laughs> And that was wind in your hair. He lied. <laughs> My name is Lindsay. I'm from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. And She's I'm like Selena Gomez, but without the swelling. Big family, very close-knit. But I don't believe in God at this point in my life. I told my mother that I was atheist, and she said that she would rather have heard that I was pregnant or lesbian. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm flabbergasted. After parting ways with the Mormon religion, no I did her. change the way that I saw myself, I kind of started to go out a little bit more, started to care a little bit more about hair. She's makeup. gorgeous, Thank though. You. Thank you. Love the legs, love the strut, needs haircut. Her hair looks like a wig that you bought in a, a store for $19.99 and it's called a Nancy. You know how they all got a name? Her wig. I thought wig she was cute. Yeah. She should have gone and bought the Tyra. <laughs> Your forehead is gorgeous, my sister. Big forehead. I, I love know. that. She's so fucking mean. I cannot. Richmond, California. When I was younger, I really didn't have a lot of self confidence. But over the years, I really found. Wait, that walk is eating though. That's a very sultry walk. That's made me a very strong person. If you believe in something, especially if you believe in yourself, you can be anything. Hello. Not the loud now. Thank you. I'm Brittany. I'm 22 years old. Hi. Did you have Red Bull this morning? No, I'm always like this. I'm like, Whoa. Whoa. ding, ding, ding. Okay. I'm a winner. I love being out there. She like tweaking. I want to be the center of attention. I need to entertain. I must have been a drag queen in a former life. I love big hair. I'm all about some big hair. Wow. Maybe I'll get a sex change so I can be a dude so I can do drag. I already have the voice. Hello, I'm Manly Stanley. Oh, Thank you. I'm not going through this. Why do you? I would love to put off? her and Janice in a room together. You know what? I like her. Shut the door. That's the kind of bye bye line. Like, come on, I like it. <laughs> Shut up. Somebody's back. Hey, I'm back. I'm Tiffany. I'm from Miami, Florida, and I'm 21 years old. Is she in a previous Last season? Time I came here, I tried out. I didn't get in. It would have been a big change from hustling to, to being a glamour girl anyway. It's cool, you know, I'm used to failing. Somebody got to fail, right? The last time I was here, I knew. Tyra I better be bring her on this season. My life. I don't jump on people and throw glasses and stuff like that anymore. <laughs> I'm just not like that anymore. I'm just not. And I'm glad I'm not. <laughs> I went back home. What were you, 19 then? Don't blame class. yourself for that. Do not blame yourself. It's a mistake that you make when you're like 19. Now. Baby, that's not you. It's great. I'm happy. I'm a happy person. Go and cry, baby. Go and cry. Why are you too? I'm strong. Because I was thinking. Pyra's gonna stand I was laying there. The, the, the bed, and I'm like, I'm laying in Beverly Hills again. And I sleep at home with my baby in a twin size bed. I was just wishing my baby, my grandmother, 
I really wish she could you see that. You guys don't think that, the, that that gay guy she is cute? Home. What's his name? The last time I was here, they said that I needed two bathing suits. And she went and she brought me bathing suits. The day before I left, I was like, I'm not well. No, no, you know, why no, the no. lights went off or whatever. She was like, cuz, bro, somebody ain't getting paid because yeah. you're going. My grandmother let the lights go off, they buy me a bathing suit. I love her so much. I just want to show my son and my family as well that I can do better. Tiffany grabbed her problems by the reins. She got it together. She came back. And I truly believe that that girl <laughs> wants to change her life. But she said, my grandma let the lights go off to buy me a bathing suit. And Rudy goes, how much was the bathing suit? <laughs> Can she be a mom? You're fucking stupid. <laughs> I'm watching America's Next Top Mom. Who is Paul? That night, did the pool thing. I'm gonna get to know some of these girls. Like, now I'm gonna get to know who's competitive. <laughs> People were so surprised because they thought, I don't know, just because I was plus, they, I'd be shy about my body. But I was just ripping off my clothes. Did she just say she's plus size? I'm just going to be exactly who I am. <laughs> Me and a few of the girls were just like, pole dances? But guys, that is not the way to go. Back then, that was plus size. I wasn't just sitting there talking and people going, yeah, I'm from Tallahassee. Thank God America Woo! disbanded and became I woke America. Too, yeah, I like to see people do crazy stuff. Oh! I don't feel I need to take my clothes off. I don't know if that's who these girls really are. I'm really interested to see what's going to happen from here on out. Here's a judgy blonde bitch. There's always a judgy blonde bitch. Go and every season. I'm just totally signed. If you're 21 and over, you're going to the two hottest clubs in LA. If you're under 21, it's a surprise. <laughs> Everyone take your tits out. I didn't even know where we were. I was looking at the street signs. I saw Santa Monica. I saw sunsets. So that was really exciting. We went to the White Lotus. It was a lot of fun. Especially to get out and just have fresh air. Why does Tyler get the jerk? The why does Tyler get the girls drunk the okay. night before? Let's go to the club. Let's go to the club. What the hell did babe I do? <laughs> why not? Uh -huh. Bowling. Oh my god. I was like, I can't even bowl. I hate bowling. I don't know about who hates it. Yeah, I hate bowling. I think it's so funny. We ended up having a blast. Matt, did you go to that bowling alley by Stop and Shop when you were a kid? Well, I, I, was it an AMC lane or something? Turns out I hated going there. The bowling alley, they My family would always take me there. I hate it. Just it was right behind the coals. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! That one was horrible. You walk over here like you're nuts. <laughs> my name is Jessica. Thought we know about a friend in Texas, Texas, and I'm 21. Friendlies after and I'm that age. Okay, Lady you Cat. Why do call yourself Lady Cat? I have long nails and I was scratched. Your face looks kind of cat-like to me. You want to see the cat walk? Oh. Oh. Yeah, we're about to rain. Right mm. <laughs> <laughs> you guys. Cause that tastes good. Oh, I'm gonna get box of chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> I'm aggressive and I am, I won't say arrogant, but just this passionate individual. How tall are you? She's 25. That's why she has confidence. I can tell you how tall you are. All these. I think you're 5'9. Oh. oh my god, I was gonna touch at you. Oh! <laughs> my god. Bye. 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 She's 78. I didn't realize how beautiful her skin is when she walked. It's giving your mom who will be dead next year. Your mom this bitch. Sarah. Growing up, I was the tomboy. My older sister. This bitch looked, looked like Aisha Erotica. Really pretty or anything like that. You look good enough. You look pretty enough. You're it's tall. the hair. You know, like that sucks, but you just move on. Skinny, straight, no boob, no nothing. Not until I was like 16 years old, 17 years old, and I finally grew up with my chest at all.
I just kind of blossomed. I guess it just took me a little while. What does that say? Holla back, back girl. Holla back. Woo! Woo! She had a nice I waist. Had great skin. Really big personality. It's like what's fun, the fun, fun. I just didn't holla back. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, everybody. Um, I'm Yuvi. Sorry, I'm really nervous. She's too mousy to be a model. Actually, right it's my sister's. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it wasn't yours. No. Yeah, I I'm tell. jeans and a t-shirt. I know. Do you have jeans and t-shirt here? Mm -hmm. Can you go back and put those on? Yeah. Yeah, so oh, I can tell that's you. not you. I love you. Okay. <laughs> there she is. You're yourself right now. Yeah, thank you guys so much. I appreciate that. When I was a kid, I went through basically every stage Hater. that you could think of. Hater. You have on your application. It says you used to be in a gang. Oh, goodness me. Being in a gang and doing all that stuff, I think it's the worst like, stage of my life. I'm just an the Homestuck gang? Like, what I gang? I talking about it. it gets me Undertale fans? Oh, the FNAFers? I just had a lot of like resentment against a lot of people, especially <laughs> not having a dad and stuff. My dad passed away when I was three. The one thing that I clearly remember growing up is my mom always telling me, your dad always wanted you to be a model. So I just knew, I'm like, okay, I have to be a model. I think she's great. Mm -hmm. I <laughs> love her. What the my hell? My name is Michelle. I'm 18 and I'm from Indiana. <laughs> That's I'm a rough the 18. Wrestling Federation in Indiana. <laughs> this is what happens. And uh, usually when I get up on the side of the ring, I do a backflip into it off the rope. Like the girls I wrestle are like 125 pounds and I like have to be able to like pick them up and kind of like fling them around. I go out there and I'll just like do my little pose and everyone's like, boo, boo. I love wrestling a lot, but I will sacrifice the wrestling to become a model. I want to be the next Tyra Banks, damn it. Lost my shoe. Hold on a second. American model, not American oh, Idol, no. babe. Oh, no, you did You like an inspirational speecher? Speak, but mm -mm. I'm not a virgin anymore. You aren't either. Oh. I do the Beyonce. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, pick up, pick. That was that cute walk. <laughs> <laughs> a little FK quick serve. <laughs> you got the bloomers. <laughs> Naima. My parents are musicians, and John Coltrane is a jazz musician. They named me after a composition of his named Naima. Tell me about this mohawk. I like her hair. I have long hair, and there was just so many things I was carrying around with me from my past and my childhood, and just craziness in my head. And I just wanted to get rid of it. I just kind of wanted to become this a mohawk. This is Rihanna's so I fault. My head the I short hair and one feather in the ear. Idea. That's Rihanna's so fault, babe. Center, my <laughs> My fellow redhead sister. My parents are the people. <laughs> I'm Brandy. Um, I'm 19. I'm from Houston, Texas. Can I just say something? I'm so jealous of your hair because it was just like bouncing left and right. But it's beautiful. Thank you. Yours is beautiful too. It's just natural. I bet your hair is straightened. It'd be like way down here. No, girl. It's not real. It's not real? Not real. What is it? It's sewn in. My mother did it. Tell your mama I ain't mad at her. This is Brandy, and you don't like it. You ain't got to like it, but I love it, and I like it. Right, so right. Me. Competition, that's the biggest word in my head right now. Right. And I'm going to be about winning. You need a shirt, you should have brought your own. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Bye. Walk. Oh, wow. It's like she didn't try. Yeah, well, <laughs> at I mean, all. Well, it's it was like she's walking down so, the yeah. grocery line, and I'm gonna get some canned peaches. Like, Nobody I walks down the grocery store seriously. like that. Are you kidding me? Hi. Uh, my name's this is Tanya. Amber. I'm from oh. Maui, Hawaii, and I'm 18. Lacey. Is that Brittany? Mahalo. <laughs> I was driving, and I heard it on the radio. There's a top model audition. She's from Hawaii. Hawaii. And I like went to the airport, spent all my rent money on a plane ticket. If I want something, I will make it happen. You said that you left high school. I like to learn by myself, by my, making my own mistakes. I'm going to go get my GED, and I'm going to pursue what I want to do, which is modeling. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you, guys. Bye. Okay, she's cute. I like her. And she's got personality. No, she. <laughs> Hi, my Oh, wow, this is a sir. I'm 22 years old. No, this is the eat right here. Bronx. This whole competition is inside. Estella, right she's now. eating. I just want it so oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. This is what's going to be a better night. Queenie right there. And my baby girl. I love that outfit. Oh, she's your daughter. 
She's gonna be three years old. I got married at 18 and we were very much in love, planned pregnancy and all. And then um, he didn't want us no more. Oh it's God. hard for me because I did everything by the book. Our baby was wanted. Oh and then my, my husband put me and my daughter out in February in cold weather. My daughter and I were homeless and living in a shelter. You're in a room with no sheets where, they're, where the first warning you get is watch out with the bed bugs and you have no sheets so you have to stay sleeping on a chair holding your child. And then my daughter cried for milk and I didn't have any money. When you can't feed your own kid and they're looking up at you and crying because they're hungry and you're like, I don't have the money, you know, like, wait, you gotta wait. I think that was the hardest. But it made you a strong person. You know what? Stronger and stronger every day. Her daughter's at, at the shelter still, Maybe on the chair, waiting for her to come back. What do you mean, where's her daughter now? This competition is a fight to me. I have my daughter to win this for my daughter's life. All it takes is to get my foot in that door. She's thickening now. She's thickening. It was the birthday party, you know, for two girls. Ding, ding, ding. Lady Cat's got something to say. Right here, I don't know your name. Oh, hold up. I thought that was rude. I'm gonna show her how to say. Right. Lady Cat, she is a handful. A crazy freak. I swear to God, she needs to stay away from me. I will slap her. But she told me what's not right or wrong about my personality. You know, I'm just looking at them. I'm like, damn, that's the way I used to act. Slap over what? I'm ready to get like stressed. Slap off. over what? In my back. Slap her over what? We get to Griffith Park. We're like all excited. We're like, hey, be little girls about it. I've been doing a cartwheel since I, I was nine. I love that we're nine. outside right now. I'm in the hotel. Great. I was walking through the crabs and it's like bees is flying up from everywhere and, and I'm not used to bees just flying and touching me. You need to move, girl. You need to move. I hate bees. Last week's episode of Drag Race was so oh. During the birthday celebration, Lady Cat it was so off. Oh. She's a little like me. <laughs> I used to be like. I hated it. Be on your best behavior because it's not worth it. You here for one reason, not to beat up on yeah, everybody. I four. feel like that was my place to step in, and give her the most advice I that I well. can. You know, just chill. But I'm still competing against her. These bees are crazy. Okay, that's. <laughs> Hello! My name is Mary, and this is my second chance. Are you 40? Thank you again. I'm not gonna pull back. I'm not gonna not show my emotion when I should have. She has a great really rap. Really am. What was going through your mind when you didn't make it last time? Oh, I felt like something had just been ripped out. This is the first time in my life I'd felt like I'd been alive. Like, I was like, wow, I'm doing what I want to do, and I'm so excited, and I'm so confident, and then, I don't know, <laughs> that's horrible. I hope this can happen for me. So, Rachel, why Ooh, are you here? what the hell? Why am I here? she a bank well, teller? You'd be representing more of a plus size. I'm down with that. My competition is everybody. Plus size? Whether they're skinny, plus tall, size. or voluptuous and, and larger than me. Plus Anything size? That I can do, I'll do it. As long as I am I'm good to go. My great parents are dead. I am Times have changed. Place. Times have changed. My name is Alexandria. I am 19 and I am from Fort Collins. Why do you Canada. talk like you're whispering into the ear of a little nymph sitting on a mushroom? Just because I had a really bad speech impediment. They actually oh. had me on a short bus. So oh, this special bus is waiting oh. for you. Well, a lot of actors and models and a lot of She speaks so fine. Like her speech is so normal and cute. I don't cute. know if you know that, but it's true. No big deal. I just to up my fat fucking doing mouth. something extraordinary with my life, having people see me for who I am. Bye. Bye. My name's Christina. I'm 24, <laughs> and I live in Tahoe. Old Sydney. grandma. Do you 24. I do lay out sometimes. Yes. Okay. You're looking like my cousin. Looking a little oh. Negro over there. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. You seem to have a, like a really tough exterior. I, mean, I do have confidence, and I'm not gonna lie. I'm not cocky, but I do. I like, carry myself well. Always have. When people first meet me, they're like. Oh, she's stuck up. You know what? It really doesn't even phase me anymore. The eyes. 
Let's really eat that. <laughs> it was just cute. Hi, how are you guys? For a girl who got Did your mom and daddy soon. talk like these? Yes. <laughs> My parents are from Latvia. Where is that? It's Latvia. next to Lithuania, which <laughs> more people have heard of. Growing up, I might have been traveling the world. <laughs> My front door. We had a nice house. Good for you. I have a front door, too. So you grew up really wealthy. Pretty wealthy, compared to most people. Now you're a waitress. My dad broke his back, so he couldn't support our family. Pretty much, I've just been kind of on my own. I your family was own. never wealthy. Well, if your father breaks his back and you lose That's everything fine. that quickly, you didn't spend your money else. wisely. That's why I'm here, I'm trying to pursue Great my Great tips, dream. though. My name's Noel, and I'm representing Reno, Nevada. This is a picture Where's of that? me and my son. Is that America? Young, not that I regret it at all. Tell me your experience about being young and, and being pregnant, <laughs> the guy. Well, I'm still with him. We've been together for three and a half years. We didn't know I was pregnant until it was last. five months. I have endometriosis really severely. I mean, I'm not supposed to be able to have kids. Endometriosis has to do with your reproductive system. I saw some and girl on TikTok has that, that and they have to take with. a it's chisel into her control. uterus and it's scrape very her uterus. I gave birth and he changed my life. He is my miracle baby. I mean, I'm, I have a kid. I'm not supposed to be able to. Yeah, she has a chronic this, illness. This is too woke for me. Feeling a self worth that is just you can't replace it. Thank you very much. <laughs> now that we've met each girl individually, we wanted to wet. compare them next to each other in a lingerie walk off to see yeah, if they could serve. It. It. <laughs> All right, no, it's Matt, I heard about that in ninth grade. I'm so serious. There was some woman in like India, and she was pregnant for literally like 50 years, and the baby turned to a rock inside of her. <laughs> Matt, did you get the TikTok I sent you of that so girl with cancer? So how long this whole process? <laughs> wow. Scary? Nerve yeah. wracking? Yeah. This yeah. is the kind of scary that can change your life. That's right. Okay. Oh, that's right. <laughs> so bye-bye! Bye! -bye. bye. <laughs> you guys been having fun? Yeah, but we know what I have to say, right? Yeah. yeah. Tomorrow morning, we're having our big elimination. First thing in the morning, a large portion of you girls are going to have to go home. Unfortunately, I got to leave you with that tonight. Good luck to all of you. I should be a UNIF model, because then you could be kind of ugly. I could model for something where you can be like kind of ugly. Hopes that I'm not going and it's only appreciated by mentally ill people. This is my dream, but at the same time, I believe what God has for me is for me. So if this is for me, I'm going to get it. Amen. God, I'm so nervous. I am petrified. Aww. We were all in there crying like we was on Oprah. Hey, you guys. Good oh, night, Serena. Sleep well and good luck at work tomorrow. Stay safe. It'll be hard getting cut. Well, them getting cut. It's gonna be hard. Not to show anyone the way, and there's no path. So, uh, uh, in I'm your face. Hopefully, I'm oh my not God. one of them. Are so we now nasty. have to do our first cut. And we're gonna go down from 35 to 20. Oh. In the room behind me, there are 20. They're getting rid of 15 girls. Each portfolio has the photograph of one girl inside, and those photographs 15 represent. Girls? 20 women that will be moving on to the next Why level even bring that many girls out here then? on America's Next Top Model. <laughs> Never had to go through anything like this. It's the most nervous I've ever been. Are you ready? Yeah! One, two, three. I guess I'm going to be sorry. And as soon as you walk into that room, doubt freaking knocks you right in the back of the head. God, really, am I going to make this? This is crazy. <laughs> Looking up. I got a portfolio, so I'm loving it right now. What about the girls who don't get one? They just have to stand there. I am feeling total tears of joy right now. They didn't pick any other plus size girls for me to even compete with that can be America's 
next top plus size. You have a beautiful big book. I wasn't crying when I saw my book, but I cried when I saw that not having a book. Lops. And just to see these girls. Well, that girl has a huge mole. Like <laughs> so hard, so hard. It's giving Caroline Polachek. I didn't make the cut. Something so big that you've wanted for so long is officially over now. Stop crying. Crying is a loser. I feel great because I'm still living. I have nine lives. Oh, I will win this sucker. Did she get a folder? <laughs> Being able to be here and actually see the dream and process coming true is so amazing. She's at okay. I like her. All the girls are incredible. I'm seriously impressed. I don't know how they're going to narrow it down. The competition, you know, is it's a little harder now, so I know I have to put my best foot forward. I've been too far with this to go back. Who will make the final 14? Don't go away. There's more top model coming up. So six more have to go. The remaining girl. 20 girls walk downstairs after the first cut and we walk into a room. This is your first picture assignment. So get in the photo booth and take your own pictures. Thank you. Gorgeous today. He could be a model. Thank you. I can pick one. I'll model Mr. Mr. Beast. You know, us to get in this photo booth and basically just show our personality. Just your eyelashes. <laughs> I'm not nervous about the photo shoot. Just nervous because I know they, they're going to be judging it. <laughs> 25, what an old lady. Me, 23. Oh. Oh, this is not working. I was like trying to catch the camera. Then I'm like, I'm like, you know what, forget it. I'm just going to look at the camera. So my pictures came out pretty messed up. This is their first that little challenge. That was like the first opportunity to size up the rest of my competition. And I totally wanted to give something Oh, she's dynamic. giving. That's it? Mm -hmm. I am going to be myself. But you learn things from other girls. Certain poses. Hey, certain it's me. Bones. You're oh, fake. I paid for a male stripper to beg on my behalf for forgiveness and sent you the video and you say nothing. I'm still banned. You really smell bad and are so evil and mentally twisted. I am going through a financial crisis. Alex. Hello, my fierce I forgot. Miss J. Hey. <laughs> okay. I'll look we right now. We have 20 girls here. We have to narrow it down to 14, and they'll be moving into the house. Okay, <sighs> not so that many girls got to go. Flat. You don't need everybody to be crazy. Like chested? I'm not crazy. <laughs> All right. Like Tatiana. she's flat chested. She may get a little rough around the edges. Any girl that can look this fierce in a photo booth is worth taking a second look That's at. That's the truth. Jennifer That's B. the truth. I love a girl that has a horrible runway walk because it gives you so much to work with. Kaylin, there's something I like about a girl who doesn't know what she's doing because that means there's the potential to really teach her something. UV. I love the. Shelly Duvall, Liza Minnelli thing going on here in the office. Giraffe arms. lashes. Yes. She's a little pear-shaped. Noel. I think that girl pops. The brightness and the shine that comes from within, it makes me want to see her in pictures. But Tyra, can I say no? L. Ooh. It's Brittany. Brittany looks exactly like Janice Dickinson. Naima. She's so edgy. She's just like, mm. Edgy is one thing, but can we take her further? Michelle D. You know how I feel about No Neck Monsters. She's got a neck. She just doesn't know how to carry no herself. No Neck Monster? Brand. Do you know what I don't like? The, the weave her mom did for her? I love Brandy's hair. In fact, she's pissed. Lindsay. She's a model from here down. And Marie Osmond from here up. Brita. I think she's beautiful, and everything is going so glamorous in fashion. She could lend herself well to that. Okay. Sarah. I love this girl's face. She can give you something. Estela. Just because of her story, I want to have her on board. But that's not a reason to bring a model into the house. There's so much deadly walk in that girl. I think she has something. Rebecca. I think she's a clean palette. She's got that little short. Mama, I don't have any hair. new messages but from you. Rebecca's a you little bit the wrong bitch. And that might not work for her. Lady Cat. I love Lady Cat's yeah. body when I do love her face. Tiffany. 
There's something about Tiffany that I she feel so that we can build yeah. and make her more versatile. I think Lady Cat is going to give us one thing. One, one two, two, three. three. Wow. Mary, look at that commercial little shot of her. Look like, at this top shot. She looks finger. so beautiful. Yeah, but I don't think it's fair, Ty, when you put one girl to compete with other girls that are not the same size. Mm -hmm. I know everybody has their favorites, but six girls have to go home. That girl's going to get that shame down. She's gonna get oh, fat shame down. I don't think I ever wanted this more in my life. I feel it with all my heart and my soul. I if like I her. I this competition. It would change everything. Me and my daughter. I would just be a blessing. Oh, God. A blessing. I forced Fatty so to send you the video it's because so I much. cannot it's message you myself. And I'm just used my to life failing is falling at apart because of this. Back I lost home, my job. My I lost my cosmetology license. It's a doubt in their mind that Tiffany might not do it. Please just unbend me so I can finally rest. <laughs> Hi, ladies. Hi. This is the final elimination. Thousands upon thousands of girls waited oh in those God. lines. And she all waited in for hours and hours, but they're not here. You all are here, and that makes you extra special. And I chose every single one of you to be here. 14 girls tonight. L'Oreal Cosmetics is where it's at. Oh my god, Mr. Bay, this your career is so over. You haven't dropped a song in years, and your last one flopped. Minus 67. First name that I'm going to call. Oh my god. Rebecca. The judgy fucking blonde bitch. Christina. She's a such a scary tweaking bitch. Kenya. I don't remember her. The next name? Brita. <laughs> Girl. Naima. I like her. <laughs> Noel. It's Is like her mom left her at a fire station, that girl. Michelle. Oh, yes! Oh, yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Sarah. Oh, my God. How did Sarah get through with that big pointy nose? Brandy! Mother. They're gonna leave the plus size girl out. How do you feel, Brandy? I just thank God for being in this line right now. Next name that I'm going to call. Brittany! Oh my God! Yes, I've been waiting for my name. Bitch is built like a giraffe. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Kayla. Yeah. She's picking all the white girls, honey. <laughs> We need the single mother to get picked, because otherwise her daughter's gonna get bit by bed bugs. The next name that I'm going to call? Tatiana. Brittany. <laughs> <laughs> Plus size girl, I don't know if she's gonna get it. Yuvi. Oh, Jesus Christ, the bar is on the floor. <laughs> this is just terrible. I have seven beautiful girls standing before me. Seven beautiful girls that came from all across this country. Seven beautiful girls that are beautiful so who's on it the be? inside as well as the outside. But I only have one name left. The last name that I call will complete this group over here. Not the single mother is getting will left be the out. Finalist. The 
last name that I'm going to call. Miss Cat. Tiffany. She picked so many boring girls. Like, I don't even remember 90% of the girls that she picked. Like, I literally don't even remember. I'm glad she might have it. Oh, Christ. No. She talked about herself. Oh. Pick so many boring <laughs> bitches. That's how I feel. Like all the girls that had interesting kind of storylines and get picked. I just feel like my heart's broken. I feel like I've, I've. This is cycle I've four by so four. I've come so far and to be, make it this far and be shut down twice. I just, I just don't understand. Why my heart is broken? <laughs> oh, get over it. I can't where you are right now, I was in this place so many times. And I cried and I went home and cried in my bed, but I got up and somebody's gonna say Yeah, I feel like she picked girls that didn't have any screen time, but we'll see. They'll get screen time and we'll learn about them. This was gonna be a transformation oh for the positive for me and my daughter. But regardless of the fact, we will come out on top, so I wish all the ladies love. Oh yeah, the makeover episode. I can't, can't that. be this good. I've never felt this good before. I like her. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, honey. Yes. I don't remember her. Oh my god, we're gonna be so happy. I went from America's most wanted to America's most model. I'm so happy. I'm just happy. Child. <laughs> Grandma. Grandma. I love America's next top model. our next episode wait they don't have episode two but i wanted to watch it You have a link? Oh my god. Come on. Try a different server? Girl, it doesn't have... The Was that a double episode or something? Let me see. Previously on America's Next Top Mom, the 14 finalists moved into their new home in Los Angeles. No, it was not a double episode. Nick, you better be good at running. Love your bestie, Alex. Thank you. I got this video, but I don't know what it's supposed to mean. Okay. Okay. Oh, there's the... This is some cookie run activities. Noonie Banoonie got Sovereign of the Abyss. Black Pearl cookie. I love that cookie. It's really cute. Good for you. Oh. What, I, I haven't been here in days. What's going on in here, honestly? Some music stuff, cookie run stuff, some chatting, some gay hate, someone wanting, oh, Pauline dominates wants a hot dog. A picture of me looking gay as fuck. Some K-pop bitches. This lady holding a big old slushy. Some Genshin activities, some furry sex. The normal stuff in the Discord. Are you gonna eat that link though? Season four, episode two. Get the fuck out of here. Look a fuck, this is getting scam. Okay, I verified that I'm a human. Little human me. I'm not looking.
looking for a traditional model. And I'm not looking for a social media model. I'm looking for both. And ladies, this cycle will have brand new judges. We're gonna find a star, you guys. We're about to throw you straight Since, Wait, I don't remember Rita Ora being here. Because it was terrible. Your walk is so together. I don't remember Rita Ora being a part of this. Okay, that season four, episode two, play. I'm a human. That humans can ride? I don't know, like this is so confusing. Okay. No. I'm not looking for a traditional model. And I'm not looking for a social media model. I'm looking for both. And ladies, this cycle will have brand new judges. We're gonna find a star, you guys. We're about to throw you straight into the deep end. Let's try it this again, because it was terrible. Your walk is so together. You're here to look like a princess. That's your job right now. <laughs> we have 14 brand new. That site is broken. Oh my god. Like, I can't have anything. I can't have anything in this life. Like, I don't know. New link in the Discord. Oh my god, period. You ate that, Rich. So you guys always have my back. No, babe. This is a giving the same. Was episode two deleted from the internet for being like super offensive or something? I found it. It's not on YouTube. Because I'm a waitress, that's fine. I'm trying to strive for something else. The colorful Brandy. My fellow redhead sister. Oh, it's a table. <laughs> Michelle, a wrestler with some fierce moves. And Tiffany. Somebody's bad. We can go back to the better website after this episode, guys. It's out just this episode model. that's missing. That's thank ho for the beer on my feet. But came back with a new attitude that earned So we can go back to it chance. afterwards. Tiffany. <laughs> Only 14 made the final cut. Yes. Tonight, their journey begins.
Yeah, I kinda killed that. I kinda killed that there. No, the intro eats so hard. I made it, I'm here. This is just like totally tripping me the out. The intro I'm eats. I'm glad to be here. I don't plan on leaving. I never thought I'd make it this far. And to like be here with these girls, they're all so tall and so beautiful. I'm not used to these being These Kayas, beautiful. I know. These are all Kayas. Oh. All these Kayas, I can't. So congratulations. You guys made it. They're going to get prom. So you guys are the final chosen 14. Forget about the subway. Forget about Broadway. Because I like Brandy. <laughs> oh my god, not Paramount you Plus. You guys are living in Los Angeles. <laughs> I assume oh, that we were going to New York. York. <laughs> now that we're living in LA, I think it'll be awesome. I Did you really buy excited. that stripper so video? Like, I'm so confused. I've ever you. Me? Yeah. Can you at least let me message you on Discord so I can provide the stripper because video I paid for yeah. for you? Being in Paramount Studios, then you'll never like hear from me right. again. <laughs> I am on a break. <laughs> I have a large Coke Zero <laughs> and I'm putting on I saw the stripper video. What? I don't get it though. Like, what is the what is the point of that? <laughs> oh, wow. Fashion police. Fashion police. Fashion police. Joan Rivers. Where are the aliens? I have no idea, but when we find them, I'm gonna shoot them. <laughs> Fabulous. Today, this is your first photo shoot, and we. We are gonna turn you, so you girls. Much. I appreciate it. I'm feeling better about it. And taking over. Man. Thank you. I did make We've it. We got our very own panel of judges working with you. All right. So we've got the tall, Carrie sexy, D. very English. I miss Carrie D. Nigel Barker, our photographer. Ladies. And of course, no lame Marin fashion stylist. And last but not least. Super sexy, super diva, Miss. Who is that? Be afraid. Be very afraid. Who is I'm that? I'm gonna walk you guys back to where hair and makeup is waiting for you right now. All right. Yeah. So follow me. Let's go. My mouth drops because it it's it's dawning on me that this is the first competition. All right, ladies. This is Danilo. He is. Looks Superstar gay. Superstar hairdresser, okay? And Mr. Matthew, makeup master. Looks gay, so these are the guys that are going to transform you today, all right? Thank you guys days. for being handed this on a silver platter. Be courteous, be on time, and have fun with it. Now you have to impress That's her true. and Jay because she will be looking at you. <laughs> How old are you? And what's your name? Rita. 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 If you haven't made it, I have not quit because this is, this is what I want to do. It's my passion. Let's <laughs> yes. turn it out. Let's get you in your outfit and let's make the match happen. <laughs> you bitches. I am petrified. I had no idea that was going to happen. I don't know if I like fun. Kathleen. That's what Danilo do if I ever saw one. Hold that face. I think Janice is extremely like I don't know about her. Scary. I want to be like, are you going to make me cry? And how many times? Okay, this is All pretty right, striking. Guys, this, looks dynamite. this is what you guys have to channel next okay. time that we play um, Roblox you know Best the the walk. No IG baddie looks. This is fashion, okay? Bottle. It's Come different. Out. It's elevated. Boom. Thank you. Exactly. exactly. Open the mouth a little bit. Change the body up. Relax the lips. Look how edgy she is. You know, she totally doesn't realize how great she is. We got her already. Where are you from? I'm from Minnesota. I was in rehab there once. Really? Hazleton? Yeah, I was in St. Mary's. Oh, okay. I did a nice stint there back in the 80s. <laughs> Lean back a little bit, sweet. Okay. You know, it's a little Wait, that's like, kind of oh, sickening, it's though. Yeah. It's kind of a Rebecca sickening look. Rebecca was a trooper who just gives off that slightly twiggy-esque feel about the way she moved. I was very impressed. Bring your body so your butt's half on and half off. There's nothing comfortable about fashion. A moat. Oh, that's no, sickening too, though. This is a good fashion yeah. shoe. Unbelievable. Nigel I being love a photographer, that. he knows what he likes, and it makes me feel like, okay, I am doing something good. Put your shoulders more profile. See, that's a mess. Just that giving right? Princess Lelia. Yeah, I think I could work that Amy look a little bit. That's not you. They, they set her, her up. <laughs> she needs to give us one step up the block. They set her up. That's a right up on here, Speedy. And it was so hot out that like my knees got really sweaty, so I kept falling off the car. 
Brittany, yes, pull it together, yes. girl. There you go. Awesome. Do you have any questions for me, bitch judge? <laughs> I, I think you're going to be one of my favorite judges. Ooh. Oh, there. <laughs> How are you? Michelle, tell Nigel. Bitch, you look a mess, girl. What you do. Oh, I wrestle. You wrestle? Yes, I wrestle. There's a sort of an unusual side to Michelle. She can go quite androgynous looking. Beautiful. She not yeah, she looks like a boy. <laughs> this is my first professional my photo shoot. I was just sitting there like, I couldn't believe it. They made us wait like forever. I'm really just tired of sitting there. That's what I am. Girl, be patient. <laughs> my strategy Don't ruin your... is oh, just no. have confidence. I'm surrounded by gorgeous girls, and I'm one of them. So, you know. You go for it. She got that tadpole she has thing a lot of moves. On. Big That's head, very little neck. You fall in love with, not because they're the most it. beautiful, I don't but because it. they inspire you to take pictures of them. You got it, right? Give me some different angles. See, now this is sickening. This is giving like punk rock. I <laughs> and I felt like one of the aliens from Star Trek. <laughs> you work like, it that's out, eating. You got it. You done. It's nice. esoteric, yeah. <laughs> oh. oh, what's wrong with <laughs> It shocked me. I was still sitting there. Haven't took a photo, <laughs> haven't took nothing. You sleepy? How you sleepy? Cause y'all take long. Honey, when you're doing Paris shows after Paris show, you're gonna be more tired than this. Brandy, she just had a really bad attitude, you know. I mean, this is her first shoot of their She needs to get it together, for she real. Up, she they're, really this excited. is gonna make them not like Brandy, her. is it? Yes, sir. Brandy not feeling it right now. <sighs> Why not? Um, because I was waiting so long, I'm not going to lie. Because you had to wait so long? Yeah, and I was getting sleepy, so I'm, I'm in the middle of sleepiness. Brandy, Brandy, Brandy. She came on the set, was in a big mood, wouldn't look at me, wouldn't smile. Well, you know what? That's not going to cut it. But she's eating that. Back the hand, change it up. You know? If you eat, you get to be a diva. Don't forget your light. Once they see how good she is, Once it won't matter. From 1 to 10, I give myself an 11. Because I think I did really good. Noel, what are you thinking about right now? I just destroyed this building. You look. Well, she looks like she's about to destroy a hard boiled egg with some salt on top of it. I don't know. That's what it's giving me. I'm a little boy waiting for me at home. I want to be able to prove to him that just because I had you young doesn't mean that I didn't make any of my dreams come true. She knocks me a touch. She looks cute. She looks cute. Now you're giving us energy. It's from Tapatio, like Amber Lynn Reed. I bet. I'm going to suck in that guy. There you go. Work it out. Ooh. Look down. She's been studying me. If go Nefertiti. Work it okay. out, girl. Hey, Sarah, you were like easiest for the day, but don't tell anyone that. The blonde, Miss Miss Blondie. You have to watch out for her body, too. Her body's a little sick. Oh, girl, wear. I'm wearing completely sheer underwear. I can't position to be comfortable when my skirt keeps falling up. This is fashion shoot. It's okay. not about, realistically speaking, you right. would do this ever. So you want to make this shot work. You don't want to be thinking of hiding yourself. Chin up all the way. Britta, she really needs to learn. But there's a bunch of men on set. Relax. She's got side of beef. That's just a bad angle. Yeah, whatever. Ready? Go. Make love to the camera. Christina was a lovely addition to the girls. That's the kind of sick in it. Interesting looking girl. I love the boobs. All right, we got That's it. That's kind of well sick in it. Walk in those shoes. Don't, don't be creepy crawling. <laughs> Last time I came here, I had an anger problem. But now all my what life has changed, now? so I know I have to put my best foot forward. Lean back on it. She's kind of gagging. Both legs that way. Get away. Never mind. A very ghetto alien. Do the other profile, look into the light, into the light. What? The light, the key light that's lighting you. Uh, Tiffany has such a sad story. I feel like I'm sympathizing with though. her life, as opposed to really objectively looking at what she does on set. There you go. I think it went pretty well for it being my first time. Jay's like laughing Not at her. Not they're like, laughing oh, at good. her. <laughs> that, that one's good. All right, yes, so it was an interesting first day. I'm gonna leave it at that. But Tyra gave me a little note. Tyra Mail says, 
Now that you've taken your very first shot, it's time to celebrate at LA's finest spot. So enjoy the night and I'll let you see and take a ride to your <laughs> We get our camera mail and it's get this little encrypted code about we go to the LA's finest spot and living the life of luxury. It's so exciting. You girls are all broke right now, please. Yeah, luxury. It's like, oh, what is all this? <laughs> okay, this has to be a shark. We're looking around. We're like, where are we going? She said right into luxury, not not poverty. <laughs> Are we in the projects? I'm done. You know, I already live in the projects. I don't need to go back. <laughs> All of a sudden, <laughs> these biker people show up. I'm like, what are, where are these people coming from? Well, I'm Ooh. Kind of Ooh. This is this is bad. They are scary. We turn around and a figure comes into the picture with all these other people. Hey girls, looking good. I'm Magnus, why don't you come on in? We are all like just wondering what is going on. Oh, yeah. Great serious clothing. Oh, that is awesome. Oh, it's a mall. Oh, it's right here. That is oh. so dope. They're designers. Who would have thought? I love that. More to this show than just looking at these rags. Okay. Step this way. Well, hey, the best part of this is actually not just what goes on downstairs. Welcome to your new home. Okay. They live in a warehouse. The rooms are kind of like the eastern parts of LA. The workout station, Muscle Beach. Sunset. Oh my god! They live in a warehouse. Okay. Fashion house. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. Here we fucking go. Anthony said that. Thank you, insane squad. I lost my job. I'm finding oh love in strippers. Everybody was amazed how beautiful me. the you house is. is. It's great. It's a beautiful thing. I'm turning I was to like, I do not. Because they I saw the stripper video. Like bunk beds at camp or something like this. I, I no saw idea. it. I'm so glad Breaking you enjoy the that. Window. They're like, all right, this is my bed. I want it. We're living in a bottle wood, baby. The Bel Air room is kind of shishi. Kind of like a 20s theme almost. Yeah, you're still right. When they were driving up there, they were like, ew, this is such a nasty area. Candles <laughs> everywhere, and it's living. awesome. I love that room. Tyra doesn't care. I'm gonna be needing to go to sleep now. Good night. <laughs> and at home, me and my fiance and my little boy, we sleep on this twin size mattress, like three mattresses stacked together. I'm happy. I am so happy. Oh, we made it, Tiffany. <laughs> oh, I'm loving this. Wow. Are they lesbians? Hey. Girl, what is this blouse? <laughs> Hope you're doing Tara's okay. Beautiful. Sending so much um, love. Like, I'm actually um, back from Bosnia once again. Me. I had so to tend to the strawberries my grandpa planted for me. They're actually in season right well, now. Like, wait, New York, hashtag Luna, world, like, hashtag Bosnia, baddie, like hashtag Mercurial Night Kitty. I'm allergic to strawberries, so you bringing them up to me is so fucking disgusting and ableist. As then, like, seriously, you should be one week banned for that because you're trying to kill me and hurt my emotions. People say, you know, I could be a model and everything. So I started going to all these agencies, and they'd say, no, thank you. I experienced probably the most rejection in my career, just so many doors slamming. Oh my god, I'm you guys can experience a lot of rejection oh, I'm not. here as well. A fruit couldn't you know, kill me, you weak one bitch. I was just joking. But I'm going to be guiding you through this whole entire process. <laughs> so I was like, why not start in my town? Yeah. 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 I mean, you see Tyra and you think boobs and lingerie. Bye, chicas. Yes, yeah, she has huge rack. And she's got a brain. I mean, who would have thought? You are a fruit. You guys need to stop being mean to me. Because if you don't stop, then you have to be okay with the fact that I laugh at somebody tweaking in the middle of their horrid pile. Because you're bad people oh. too. Oh my god, this is And that's nice. it. I think I'm gonna eat the worm when I get through it. Yesterday, the man messed up my hair, teasing it, and I look like a fool right now. I look like a dog on the junkie on the street. Begging for some change. Y'all might as well throw some quarters at me. I don't think Brandy's as open as I am. You can shave my head bald. You can do whatever. Are they gonna do makeovers you know, in this episode? Be easy to work with. No, right? It's too early. I feel. Perfect. 
they are. Oh, look up period. Hey. I think her finger went her butthole a little bit. When I saw Jay again, oh, I love him. He's like one of the girls. Practice makes perfect. Good, bitch. So you guys get finished. And what we need to do is we need to kind of do weights and measures. Oh my god, thank you so much. Insane slug. <laughs> Thank you. I've done it. Take I off myself. If you get a message from me again, please don't answer because it's I'm my ghost and you'll be cursed, because so you must I've ignore it recently. at all costs. Well, I usually do ignore your messages, so we should be okay Ms. there. Ms. Taylor, step up. <laughs> 114 <laughs> pounds, baby. Wow! She's smaller than me! You almost shake like a boy minus the breast. <laughs> Thanks! Woo! It's giving boy? Yeah! Michelle, she has a future behind her. Yes. Yeah. Oh, oh, sorry. You are 118 pounds. That legit was it. You're, you're getting framed. 124. What is 16? 123. I'm, I'm not one of the skinny girls. I'm not. I'm nervous. I'm ner Yeah, you know, fine. I'm nervous. <laughs> Next. 116. Brita. I gained 10 pounds. <laughs> That girl looks like a tweaker, not her. I've been sick. Baby, when you're normally you're sick, you lose I'm weight. I'm the opposite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 138. Trust me, in the end of this, I'll, I'll lose it. She is just a little bit bigger than the rest of us. I hope being weighed in today isn't making her feel that self-conscious because she's beautiful. That's true, Rebecca. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. <laughs> They need to stop worrying about their weight and worry about their facial structures. Cause there's a bitch in here with the it's thinnest a, eyebrows ever and the eyes of a fucking angler fish that hasn't seen the light of day in like 20 years. Somebody's like, getting cut and it's, it would be like horrific for anyone that made it this far to get cut so early. This is really hard for me. Really I know, I, I don't want to see people go, but I mean... I know, there's only gonna yeah, be one it person is that went. I know that, but like... Ugh. And since, like, it's There's a bully so and they're so fucking it. nasty, it's what? Gonna be rough oh my god. Hannah Bay, it's time to wake up. Okay. No more sleeping, baby. Who do we think goes home we first? Don't mail. answer That's if you already watched it. <laughs> Thank you so much, I Izzy. I really honestly don't know who's gonna go home. It's gonna be definitely a surprise. It's not a good game. We need to leave right now. Somebody has to get cut. I don't know. I mean, so much speculation, I can't even handle it. Hello! Hello. Ladies! So, I know you got the tire mail. Who's gonna get cut? Where are we today? <laughs> Makeover! <A> Makeover! <laughs> you guys are at the pre bay salon. Have some amazing folks come on out here. First, we have Guy. Guy's gonna be totally in charge of your looks today. Miss Carmen is from the paint shop, gonna be hooking up your nails today. And then we have Motoko. So she's gonna be doing your makeovers for your faces. Right, They're gonna oh. fuck up Brandy's hair. Yes. They're gonna Sarah, fuck up Brandy's hair. We're gonna hair. give you a very Peter Pan inspired haircut. Michelle, we think that you have a very Ethereal look, so we're gonna make you ice blonde, girl. Noel, we're gonna blow you out, girl, and make you fierce. Tatiana, we're gonna darken you and make you very rich, a la Paulina Porskova. Tiffany, you got a big ass, crazy personality that can handle hair all the way down to here. Kaylin, we're gonna give you a hair weave, very blunt, a la Carmen Cass. Brittany, we're gonna have to take you a little bit shorter, make that bang very heavy and very oomph. Christina, we think that you have a face like the girls on the cover of Vogue right now, so we wanna make you like those hot girls of the moment. Deeper, darker, fuller Christina hair. is Rebecca, a nightmare. We wanna edge you out. Thick and long and luscious. She's gonna get edged? I wanna get edged. Rita. You're gonna get these little tight little waves yes. like a oh, yeah. princess bride. UV. Oh, yeah. UV reminds me of a new type of Shelly Duvall. So we're gonna make your hair shake red. Oh, yes. Kenya, you're gonna.
gonna get an old kind of Vidal Sassoon inspired asymmetrical Metro. bang. Naima, we're gonna make you honey blonde, girl. Brandy. Miss Brandy, we have thought about you and we decided, girl, that you are fierce. And we ain't Wait, doing we nothing, nothing to you. Nada. You are fierce. When she told me I was gonna keep the afro, I'm pissed off. I was just like, why? Because I wanted a drastic change so bad. Why is she mad about it? It's so yeah, cute. Yeah, find out if blondes have more fun. Exactly. <laughs> Remember blondes? Now I have an excuse to be stupid. Hey! I'm gonna need to move. I'm, I'm sorry. Y'all hurting my feelings right now? Your feelings are being hurt? Yes, because they're all over. So we're gonna get a new look. I'm sorry. I'm not getting a new look. We were having issues in the beginning for Brandy about her hair. Do you feel the dreads up in there? It is? Oh, yes. Yes. I'm gonna need them to cut it out. I'm sorry. Randy, I'm gonna have to take this off, precious. We're gonna make you really, really short, but really nice bright orange. still. Stop teasing that word. Okay. Because this is coming up. I'm very happy about the change or whatever. Okay, I so she is getting one. Up. So are they cutting her? Yes. That's now? Finally, she was so cranky at first. Just do me good. Just do me good. That's all I ask. First time ever being blonde? Yeah, ever. Ever. A virgin. I love this. I'm getting my first official weave with long extensions. Feels like the ripping I wear. But it, it better be beautiful. Oh, cute. Yeah. And it's going to be a shot that's going to be top of shot when you show her breast. Nude? I am a little uncomfortable being naked. I knew somewhere within this competition there was going to be a she looks good though. something. I just wasn't she expecting looks good. it to be so soon. Yeah, she looks right good. They made my hair darker. She I really looks like good, it. Girl. I think I did a great job in the photo shoot. I feel very confident. She did okay. It's okay. It's okay. I definitely like the darkness and the richness of my hair. Christina is scary. Michael, so I she kind of like looks like that actress from Sex and the City. I'm actually really happy that they decided not to do a crazy makeover on me. I've had makeovers in the past. I always come back to this look and this what works for me. Nah. I have had a sewn in weave before, but this time I'm sitting here for much longer. The blood is all rushing to the spots where she's braiding. I just taking it like a pro, I think. Okay. A weaveologist? Good. I'm bald headed again. I think you still look sexy. I'm sorry. I'm going to go straight for the next photo shoot. But you still have you still have something to work with. My makeover is very funky and it's very edgy. So I feel like Wait, she it eating. definitely shows a different side to me that I really enjoy. <gasps> She kind of ate. Oh, honey, they burnt the fuck out of your hair. It was gonna hurt and everything, but oh, girl, they fried your shit. It, it was vicious. Oh, honey. Oh, girl, they fried your Michelle, shit. Michelle, she's feeling the pain of being a bleach blonde. It is extreme. That hair is ruined for real. Michelle's so. I don't know the Girl, it does not she hurt that complain. bad. She won't complain, and I love it. It does not her. hurt that bad. She's living so so wrong. It. it does sing, oh but to make you shake. The hottest Peter Pan I've ever seen. No. I think I look fantastic. I love the cut. I love the color. Ooh, that's. I love the makeup. I love it all. <laughs> I feel like a supermodel. It's gonna look so dope. I like it. I would have probably chosen a really oh. really light color or a really really dark color, but this spot in between. You know is, what? It suits her. Perfect. I love it. It suits her vibe. Check out. Yeah, look this exactly the same my entire life. Jeez. That hair is gorgeous. I just feel like a completely new person. I, I love it. Put me in that time capsule. I'll keep this forever. <laughs> now that's blonde. They put me through hell. But, um, I mean, I'm loving it now. It's kind of sickening. Wait. Because I'm feeling more confident. I think blonde Wait, it's kind of sickening. Wait, she looks so good. Just, if we can keep it very, very blunt. I didn't know it was gonna be so blunt of a cut. It kind of crushed me. I mean, I have no choice. But what if it eats, Mama? Say. But it's not I what I want to do. I mean, this is something it's... that both Jay, myself, and Tyra said no talked about. We can get Tyra on the phone. Do you want to talk to her about it? No, I'm fine with it. 
Wait, well, you're I'm, so right, Luna. I didn't even think about that. Because, because I have like all the hair, so it is easier for me. Cool. I love my new makeover. Seduction, seduction. My makeup is a lot different than what I'm used to. She gives me turtle. Like, I just can't get past it. I just got my makeover and I'm hot. Hello. Major bang power. Love it. You better do rag rap. I'm so excited. I have a new, totally different look that I would have never thought of. I'm so happy. This day decided to give my baby a makeup. Oh, this is a God. guy, but he looks Whoa. cute. I hope these eyebrows come out right. I had to get my makeup done for the photo shoot, but the that was are black. long. That's not gonna. That be was long. I'm gonna go back to my boyfriend. I've never seen them give He's a not girl gonna want me hair that long. Woo! Whoa! Brandy, your attitude is just ridiculous. I'm sorry. I don't care who don't like me no more, but I can't see my eyebrows. Miss Brandy. Her attitude just pissed me off. Unfortunately, it's like you, Kenya's got some going on with her hair. I don't know what's going on there. And it's like, I'm getting frustrated now. You know, I'm, I'm reaching a point where, child, here, talk to Jake. What's the problem? No problem. Is it you? This looks so good. I can't believe it. So I told you. I can't, I really can't believe it. Like, today, the drama was so not intended. I'm not the type of person to ever, ever complain. So I am in love with this hairstyle. Oh, that it's is gorgeous. cute. I always thought about having a short hairstyle to make my face, my structure stand out. So oh, much. that is cute. Yeah, that is really hey. cute. Hey, hey, everybody! Did Tyler get I a want tits done? Everybody to come over here. Part of being a top model is about accepting change, about being a blank palette. I have the top people in the industry here <laughs> that have molded and shaped my career, and I want to commend twelve of you for being open. But there are two of you and you I give up. This is I am. You bitches hit a girl with a personality. Next so what if I'm a little weird? You ate that. At judging. And this will definitely affect that. Oh. So I'll see you guys at judging. There were a lot of good makeovers in this. There were a couple ones I thought were really oh, ugly, but... Tired out. Tired out. I liked Tomorrow most of them. with the judges. Only 13 of you will continue on in hopes of becoming America's next top model. One of you will be eliminated. I think it's going to come down to Brandy and I. And they're going to make a cut out of us, too. I really need a miracle right now because I do not want to get eliminated. You need to change your attitude. I think Brandy's done for. Thanks. She's getting the eliminated edit. Anger, Nobody likes her. They make her look like a Okay, mother. <laughs> Mind you, Hi, I bet all these girls are Welcome like to that. your first Every single one of them. judging experience. You guys look amazing, but someone has to go home tonight. Hi, yes, we I am new to this channel. We have some amazing Prizes. You're new the to first this is channel. a contract oh God, with an international you? You model management this? company, Ford Models. A spread in L magazine, which will be shot by a world-renowned photographer, Gilles Ben Simon. And last but not least, a one hundred thousand dollar contract with CoverGirl Cosmetics. Oh my God! Oh my God! I'm screaming. Now it's time to introduce our panel of judges. First, we have Janice Dickinson, one of the world's first supermodels. Hello. Unknown. Nigel Barker, a world-renowned and noted fashion photographer. Unknown. Nole Marin, a prominent editor and stylist. Unknown. Hello, ladies. So now it's time for your individual evaluations. You had a photo shoot where you were aliens on the loose. And Naima, you're first. The first picture of this whole experience is Naima, and here it is! She kind of ate. I like the slinkiness. Your first photograph, you really pulled it off. Noelle. First off, Noelle, you had that beautiful blowout. What happened? I wanted to see what it looks like curly. Big oh, mistake. So you mess with a good thing? Here is your best shot. Not she undid her makeover. Yeah, you were. Might be That's making okay. up for that curly hair you got right now. Christina. Here it is. She's scary. I, she kind of ate that though. Look at that. Dance flies. She kind of ate Michelle. that. 
Not the shot of her. But one thing eyes. I want to commend you on is your makeover. I heard that it was burning, but you were very model esque. Bitch, it's took thickening. There's it. a famous hairdresser by the name of Orbe. And I remember having new hair extensions. It's painful. But he's <laughs> pulling it and pulling it and pulling it and twisting it to these Princess Leia buns. She had the and I wanted to cry so bad and maybe a little teary, you know, but I kind of hid it from him and sucked up and got an amazing picture. And that's what it's about. It's about pushing through the pain and the discomfort. It's a mouth so there, Tyra. Bravo. And here is your best shot. You look fabulous that's cute. with your body, but the face, you didn't nail it for me on that one. Tatiana. I've got to tell you, you, out of all the girls, had more moves than anybody else. A lot of girls didn't. They were like, oh, I didn't know I could do this. Rita. Kind of my name is Frita. Rita. <laughs> oh, Rita. Okay, Rita, here's your best shot. That's not a good shot, honey. You look worried. You look old. <laughs> I don't see what I see in front she of you. She is worried this and looks old. Yeah. This is this is not even a, a one. Sarah. This makeover is so nasty, oh. though. This is a hot shot. It was fun to shoot you. Oh God. Kayla. You know what? You were unbelievable out there, and you're not rocking my world. You in know front this of me theme right for now. this shoot is kind of nasty. Wow. I mean, you were like a beautiful dumb girl. That police car. The only issue that we had is that you had an easy tendency to make the picture look too sexy. Just try and be a little bit more elegant. Kenya. That's, is that the hairstyle that they did? Because I was not there no, at the end. it wasn't. I had actually put some oil in it and it got really stringy. What were you thinking? I don't want to hear that. You were one of the girls that I was addressing, feeling like you knew better than me and Jay and Jay. I regret that. I feel like it was the biggest mistake I've made in my life. <sighs> Putting oil in your hair isn't the biggest shot. mistake of your life, girl. This is yes. gorgeous. The lesson that you like, need to learn hot. is that if I said that I wanted your makeover to be this hair, <laughs> that you need to sit there and say, oh, God, it's fierce. Yeah, I love it. UV, here is your best shot as an alien. You look like sleepy alien. You could have been fierce, and you're not even close to a growl. Tiffany. The hair she totally looks helped so you. Look completely model -esque. Gorgeous. It is gorgeous, but I noticed that we had to get you into that profile because when you look straight at us, you often looked like bewildered, but you did a good job. Last season of America's Next Top Model, you didn't make it. And one thing that you said was... It would have been a big change from hustling to, to being a glamour girl anyway. And now you are a glamour girl, and I want to know what yeah, you feel when good. you look at that picture. It's, it's beautiful. I just... It's okay. It's really hard always having to be tough, you know? When people see me on the street, it's always oh, that girl that fights or that tough girl. And when I look, I, you know, I could be beautiful and it feels great. It makes me feel good. I think adversity and negative things actually make us better artists because it's something that you can pull from. That's something that's beautiful. Rebecca. Hard. Hey. Hard. Hello. You look long, lean, and totally fashion forward. <laughs> Work it, girl. I'm down with it. Last but not least, Brandy. Brandy's going Brandy, on. Brandy, so you are working this new look, but I know it was a struggle getting there. When you were like, well, we're going to cut it all off, I was like, it was like a relief. So I was like, okay. Oh, you're just leaving off the other part, just like a little girl in front of her mama. Wait, 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 wait. wait. You nothing. were very negative about eyebrows being bleached, saying that you looked crazy. I never once said, I don't like you. You're the only girl who actually had the audacity to, when she arrived on my set. I said, how are you? I said, I was waiting so long, I'm not going to lie. I'm in the middle of sleepiness. And I was like, oh. <laughs> you can't say that to a director. It makes me... I don't like this female judge. First of all, I want to go to your shot. Let's go to your picture first. She's a little bit harsh. It's good. a beautiful picture. And you had lots of good pictures, but it wasn't fun to have you around. I want to take you back to the semifinals when I called your name. Brandy! You had one of the biggest responses. <laughs> Where is that thankful person? All we've experienced is Brandy Beautiful on the outside. So now it's time for the judges to deliberate. And when we call you back, we will determine who's going home. Oh my god, I just don't know. Brittany. She stays. Is it because she looks like you, Janice? You know, you really need LASIKs, honey. I don't have hands the size of a baseball mitts here. 
Tiffany. She's so mean. Tiffany jumped in and out of that car. It looked like she's seen those red lights before. But, honey, you got the shot. Sarah. Her face is so strong that it could carry her. That guy's a little song. racist, honey. Naima is a little she racist. She has this personal style about her, which I noticed from the get go. UV. He needs to go. He needs to go. That's her new name. I have deemed it. I think SUV is so cute, but in the photograph, she, she looks, looks like a man. Pina. Tonight, her hairdo yeah. looked like a helmet on the side of her head. It's getting she boy. She clean up that attitude and pretend like it wasn't as bad Sorry, as it was. It. Oh, she was. Oh, beyond Miss Diva, Christina. I'm she kind of is that. The problem is, that she has almost zero sex appeal. <laughs> She just, you know, she's just given too much attitude. I'm sorry. You can't be a There's model here. Definitely, I don't want to fuck you. Great picture of this girl, mm -hmm. but who wants her around? Frida is a very <laughs> sexy girl in person. My God, photograph. Eh. Britta's 25 years old. She's cut. She's holding way too much weight, and on top of that, she was a very stiff model. Kaylin. She worked this image, but when I saw her in person tonight, she really <laughs> just looked. Dry. I love how they're not judging the photo shoot at all. They're just like, yeah, she's old, this she's bad. This girl moves like the girls that are working in magazines already. Tatiana. Her face is almost <laughs> like a Nose and mouth and eyes is all touching each other. Noel, she's a really pretty girl. I don't like that she changed her hair once again. If if she can't bring it home, bye bye. Michelle. The thing about her is that she's so big, she borderlines looking like someone in drag. She definitely has potential, and I would like to yeah, give Q, honey. Flash Michael, contender. <laughs> <laughs> I have 14 absolutely beautiful women standing in front of me. But I only have 13 pictures in Oh my, my god, hands. I missed this show. And these this pictures so represent the 13 of you <laughs> that are still in the running towards I'll becoming the America's Next Top Model. The first name that I'm going to call... Tiffany. Tiffany, not first call back. Oh my god. Congratulations. Famous. You're still in the running towards becoming America's Next Top Model. Naima. I like Naima too. Rebecca. I don't remember Rebecca. Kaylin. I don't remember her. Congratulations. Oh, that's Kathleen. The next name that I'm going to call? Christina. You know what? I kind of like Alien Eyes. She's kind of queenie. Noel. Congratulations. There's four girls left, but I only have three photos in my hands. Oh, fuck. The next name that I'm going to call, UV. UV did a mask. Kenya. I think Brandy's done. Like, she got the eliminated edit since Somebody the Somebody learned a big lesson this week, didn't they? Huge. Congratulations. Will Brita and Brandy please step forward? I liked both these girls. I only have one photo in my hands. And this one photo represents the girl that will still be in the running towards becoming America's next top model. I don't know. And the girl who's that I get do it. not call must immediately return to your loft, pack your belongings. Rita, you walked in here I don't know. and all the judges said, wow, what an amazingly beautiful girl. But then the judges evaluate your photo. Well, they think Rita's too fast. To Brandy, you're standing there high fashion and edgy. All the potential in the world. But your attitude isn't something that judges want to be around. That <laughs> attitude weighs one more pound than it's A lot of these judges cool. behind me don't want to see you either. Oh. I don't know. But some of them do. Brandy, congratulations. Oh. Not fatty Thank going you so on. Much. Thank you so much. What are you going to try to work on? My attitude. Thank you so much. 
Congratulations. <laughs> You're still in the running towards becoming America's next top model. Oh my God, I'm gonna... Thank you for your time. I'm just pissed off right now. I'm actually regretting this experience a little bit. I didn't like First girl kicked much. off. Pictures were horrible. Ugh. The picture was not good. God, this sucks. The picture was not good. I was hoping good. that this would be the next bigger, better thing for me, and I blew it. I think it's time I clock out here. We'll definitely be watching more next time. Because I love watching America's Next Top Model. <laughs> but it's super late. It's 12.30 and I don't want to be loud and get in trouble. I'm going to keep this VOD up overnight in case anybody missed these two episodes. Okay, thank you guys for watching. Everyone sleep well. And I'll see you next time.